game. That's what we want. Game face. Hi, how are we doing? It's a weird week. It's always a weird week. But it's a strange week because it's supposed to be Monday, but it's actually Tuesday. Because I had Friday, Monday off. And if you've paid attention to the... Say paid attention. If you've called the um, shorts on the peripheral media, peripheral media, peripheral mic YouTube channel, you know why. Because um, I was having a bit of a rough time recently. So my wife fantastically... Oh, I see. <coughs> testing, testing. Thank you very much, developers. <laughs> See, that's this is fucking problem. Go XLR, you lying shit. Okay. Sorry about that. This one here is my headphones. Go XLR. This is why I changed it to my headphones. Joe, I'm kind of glad when this will this Go XLR will die of die of death because it's not very good. It's all right, but it's it's very much just the pretty colours that sold it to me. And now I'm just like, I could have gotten the road the road thingy caster for as much money, and that would have that would have been really good. I think mean, that would have been just as good a job. I'm looking at myself because I'm a narcissist. Uh, right, stop this. Stop this, Tom fuckery. Uh, play. That's what we want. That's what we want. So we're going to carry on with the arcade paradise. That's the only plan for today. I doubt. Why have I got a weird thing? Am I? Oh, I'm windowed. That's why. I'm windowed, but the game is not. Sorry, the the game is windowed, but my screen is not. That should sort itself out in a second. No, anyway, should be full screen windowed. Anyway, yeah. So I've not been doing too well recently. I've been a bit down in the dumps and a bit of a miserable fuck. So my wife fantastically organised a trip to our favourite um, glamping spot. Uh, so I got to sit in a tent for a few days, um, look at some cows, touch some grass, read some spooky stories, and walked around a garden for a bit. Like, walked around a um, stately home garden, which was really nice. I saw a castle and some flowers, and I saw where a tree had died, and it was really nice. So I feel very much recharged now. What, have we, what did we get delivered? What did we get? Oh, Vostok. Oh, right. Okay. So this is the weird thing. So I've done day... Yeah, I'm going to put that over here. Oop. I'm going to have loads delivered now, aren't I? So this is a weird thing because we finished on this day last time. I finished this day and then quit. But it's now reverted me back to the start of the day previous. So communists from Mars are going to go there. Excuse me. This week is pure... Pure, pure, pure arcade paradise because I'm really, really enjoying it. Um, and I'd quite like to see the end, to be honest with you. So I'm thinking just complete playthrough. And then we can say, done it. Arcade paradise, nailed it, mate. Absolutely, absolutely slammed it. So, some penguin push. That's a DLC cabinet. It's because I've got more grown up money than sense. <laughs> Did I just buy all of them? Let's fast forward this. <laughs> Da, 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 da. Yeah, that's one, huh? Oh no, there we go. Oh yeah, I must have. Oh, I'm on. Uh, I need a move. I genuinely need a move. You need me to move, friends. Cause you can't see the money on screen. You don't need to see the money on screen. It, that's just the money in our pocket. Basically, we've got $15 in our pocket, right? But the money in our pocket we can't spend. That's just as much money as we... Oh, no, don't do this to me now. Don't do this to me. Thanks, Mikebot. Thanks, Stream Elements. Thanks for telling me right now that I'm live. I've been like that for a while. Come on, come on, come on. Yes, yes, yeah. Beautiful. Uh, How do... Oh, I don't know. I play this with mouse and keyboard. Ooh, how weird. I'm all, I'm all floaty. Okay, so. Why does the music stop when I go towards the laundrette? That's really weird. Right. Shut up, phone. Fucking. That's what I get for living nearer. Uh, thing a uh, that um, film grain effect is screwing up my green screen. Video options. 
Bones. Film grain? No. No film grain. It's still I'm still slightly transparent, but I'm using I'm using thingy, so I'm using um NVIDIA broadcast, so I don't really know what to do in regards to that. Do I turn my lights up? Will that work? No, that would just make me blind. Oh no, that's Max. Oh no, that's not what I want. Turn it down. Turn it turn it down. <laughs> there we go. No, down. Guys, seriously. Right, there we go. That's now just laminated. There we go. I'll just gown with it. Just gown with it and do it. Everyone knows that I've got shit video issues. Anywho, so how do you crouch? Let's go crouch. Oh, I have to pick gum. I forgot. I've got all the nuances of this game. How many of these have we done? 64. Nearly the nicest number. So let's clean up. And then we can go play our new arcade game. Which will be exciting. My volume's not terrible, is it? So you should be able to hear the radio in the background. Not my radio, obviously. I'm not insane. Um, but you should be able to hear the in-game radio in the background. And then me, my lovely dulcet of tones over the top of it. And I crawl around the laundrettes. Oh, I've got a full bag. I need to empty my bag. It's an amazing shell suit, friend. That right there is a shell suit. With slightly translucent hair. Just like me. Yum. Empty. Uh, yep. Boom. Incredible. Incredible. Oh, a to-do list item was completed. How do you find to-do list items? To-do list items. Take ten pieces of trash to the dumpster. Fantastic. Defeat one hundred enemies with the minigun in one game of Zombat Two. Nope, because that's horrendously bugged. Collect ten coloured stars in Woodcar's Adventure. Yeah. How much is that for? 10 human pounds. I will not be. Oh, there's so much fucking washing to do. Oh, my days. This is really weird doing this in uh, with mouse and keyboard. I don't know how I feel about it. I feel I feel awful that I'm using a, a space. I've you left a, an orphaned uh, washing machine there. Pick up. Pick up. Pick up. Look, you gotta do your chores first. This is how I was raised. You gotta do your chores first and then you can do the fun bits. Right? If you don't. Okay, that's fun. If you don't do your chores, you can't reward yourself with fun. That's how it works. <laughs> that's how it worked in my life. <laughs> I had a very traumatic childhood, so <laughs> what the fuck do I know? Um. There's more, more magic laundry. Right, so how's everyone's day been? I don't know who's watching at the moment, because um, we check, but I hope everyone's had a, a good day. It's been a weird, like I said, it's been a weird Tuesday, because technically it's Monday for me. But, uh, God, I just spawned out of nowhere. Hmm. Right, what, what, what have people been up to? What have you been up to? I want to know what people have been up to. Uh, I like to live vicariously through you because I've not left this desk all damn day. <laughs> well, I have. That's, that's not true. But. No, I don't want to play. No. No. How do how do exit? Q. I need my controller. I can't do this on mouse and keyboard. Oh my days. I'm such a pleb. I'm such a pleb. Come on. Wakey, wakey. Ooh, invisible controller. Come on. You can do it. I believe in you. Then I can also lean on the desk as well, which is pretty sweet. So, it's one of the many benefits of uh, having a ginormous desk. Come on. You're nearly there. It's over there. It's there. I can see the Bluetooth thing from here. I, you can 100% you can do it. I believe in you. You've done this before. Just staring at the floor of an arcade. An arcade floor as well. That's going to be well dirty. There we go. You got it. You got it. How do you pick this up? 
pick pick up garbage. Oh, this is going to be one of those buggy bits of garbage, isn't it? Okay. That's fine. So we've got a lightning game now, which is pretty cool. I remember last time saying that that made me want to play um, House of the Dead Remake with the light gun that I have. Pick up trash. There's normally three bits of gum. Oh, the washing thing. There's normally three bits of gum, and I don't think I picked up three. I think I picked up two. Put this in a dryer. Yep, that washing's also done. God, I really do wish my watch did that. Just let me know specifically. Wait, is my... I don't know, because I can not change my bloody window settings. I'm going to assume my notifications are wrong. I actually don't know. I'm assuming they are. Who knows indeed. There's a chance I might need to nip to the front door shortly. Because I have a parcel coming. And Amazon in their infinite wisdom. They're like... It'll be delivered between four and seven, and oh sorry, four and six, and now it's like half five and half seven. Summer of sports has broken down. Oh no, we're good at summer of sports. We did uh, loads of, that's what we were doing. We were picking um, games to get all the challenges in, weren't we? That washing's done. Oh, it's four stops away. That's good. That's good. Just in time for mushroom. Just in time for mushroom to start. That's fantastic. So for anyone interested, there's also going to be, at some point, today, uh, tomorrow, or Friday, there's going to be a giveaway. I'm going to give away a copy of this game. Um, this is not sponsored or affiliated, but I need to put this in the... Oh no, I just put that in the washing. Oh, I've forgotten how laundry works. Um, it's not sponsored or affiliated by anybody. What I'm going to do is basically uh, pick a winner. No, that's not what I uh, Pick a winner. Uh, go on to gog.com. Buy a PC copy of the game and then gift it to someone. That's basically what I'm going to do. I'm going to give you a, a copy of the game. Because I just, I feel much better about that rather than going, Oh, this company has given me so many copies of the game to give away. And like, I've done that enough in my life. I don't feel like I need to do that anymore. Are they, oh, we've actually got a snack in here now. What have we got? We've got bullseye. Good. Good, good. It's not like... No, okay, there's not stuff stuck to there. Right. Put that in here. So eventually, I like to think that we'll get rid of some of these washing machines. Uh, our to-do list. Collect ten coloured stars in Wood Girls Adventure. Oh, someone was supposed to broken down. Fuck, I completely forgot about this. Let's go bust some bugs. Absolutely. As an ex-software tester, I can attest that is exactly how you get rid of insect, uh, how you get rid of software bugs. Oh, it's four stops away. Oh, that's good. That's exciting. I'm getting a new keyboard, so that's that's very nice. And some dumb magnets as well. <laughs> it's the keyboard that's the most important thing. Uh, right. I'm dumb. I don't know what we're doing. I'm just faffing around. I'm letting my brain not think. Uh, Arcade Mania. Shuttlecock. So we've got £1,442 in the dollars in the bank and £90. The pounds are you the dollars are used to buy arcade machines, the pounds are used to um buy permanent upgrades for character. So there's only a couple of others we can get now. So there's a four grand pool table and a two grand shuttlecock game so we need to just just rinse money that's what we need to do just, just absolutely rinse money uh the drying was done sorry yeah the drying was done. That was it. are you still four stops away you're still four stops away God, if it's just an a ranking i have to just have to remind myself that's a good rank a is a good score is a very good spot. Now this is this should be immediate. So we put this in immediately. Right, I'm taking that immediately. Ah, uh, God, I'm stuck. Nope, it's not. <laughs> the game is fixed, man. I'm telling you, absolutely fixed. More dry and done. Grab the laundry. I 
think I'm going to start focusing less on the laundry. Because we don't really get a lot. We get a couple of hundred. That's about it. And we don't really get a lot else. So I'm more interested in... There's quite a few uh, things to get on the old arcade management list. So... God, oof, got loads more games. Uh, attack vector goals. Down 330 chops. Score 30 and summon wood guys. So we've done that. Don't think we're going to do 330 attack choppers. Block chain. Get a chain of 9. Wholly uncover 3 conspiracies. Uncover all conspiracies. Get a high score of 50,000. Get a high score of 150,000. Yeah, it's 150,000. Um, we could try that. Let's see what else we've got. Championship darts. Win three games against the AI. Hit the bullseye ten times. Win with a six dart finish. I don't really know what that means. Win with a six dart finish. And hit a 180. Okay. Let's let's do some darts. Come on. I don't... There we go. Single player. Championship darts. Nyam. Donk. Is that bullseye or not? It looks like a bullseye. Oh no. I fucked it. Thonk. Right, hang on. That's, this isn't optimal playing, is it? I've got to go for like triple 20. Oh, this is fighting me every second. Come on, up we go. There we go. Meow. Thunk. I remember that much. I don't think that's my character. I think that's J Dog. Thunk. Oh, wait, no. That's. Oh, I get it. 180. Which is 180 is it's three triple twenties, right? Two, four, six, six, twelve, eighteen. Yeah. Oh, I fucked it. I can't take it back. <laughs> Boink. That's double, right? And that's triple. My very limited knowledge of darts. Ooh. There we go. Still four stops away, Amazon. Cool, cool. Nope, screwed that. I think I might be a one. Yep, that's a one. Boink. Boink. We got three, a five, and a three. So I need eighty-five to be J Dog. That's twenty. Cause I can't aim. Sixty. That's eighty. No, that's also... No, that is 60. Cool, so now I need a 5. Which you'd assume would be easy for me. There we go. And it is, because I'm an absolute legend. Ding. What do you mean, red? What? I don't know what that means. Why did you do that? Why is it still 85? Surely that's a that's allowed, right? I don't know darts. I do not. I do not understand darts in this line. T at 15, D 20. I don't get this game. This game's dumb. This game's proper dumb. <laughs> uh, what else can we play? Uh, what's communists from Mars? Get a combo of 10, deploy a 1,000 nukes, get a high score of 10,000, and make it past wave 8. Where is communists from Mars? Did I put it over here? Communists from Mars. Oh, it's Iron now. It's thingy. P 
Kyum. Deploy nukes? I don't understand. Is that what I'm doing? Am I deploying a nuke? There. Let me just pause a second. Uh, yeah, deploy 1,000 nukes. So fire 1,000 times. Right, I just go get the door.
Completely invisible, greeny green. Completely invisible. Oh, dearie mate, you're the next stop. It's very subjective, Amazon. Very subjective. But live unboxing of new keyboard, which you can't see. There you go. The MX Keys Mini. The Logitech one. The baby brother to this bad boy out here. Oh, real, real fan of chiclet keys, I'm not gonna lie. I like small form factor chiclet keys, so. And, what else have we got? I'll tell you what we got, we've got some of the cutest magnets you've ever seen in your life. Well, they might have the cutest magnets you've ever seen in your life. But. Puzzle stuck together. Basically, they look like push pins for a notice board, but they're magnetized. And I'll take a photo afterwards and stick it on the Discord. But they're to go on this. So I've got three monitors. I got three metal stands, risers for these monitors because I don't have wall mounts or anything like that. Or um, monitor arms because I think we've been lied to by big monitor arm. Buckle in, folks. It's that sort of stream. Uh, I think we've been lied to by big monitor arm. I don't think we actually need monitor arms anymore. I think my monitors on their original biological feet are more sturdy than they have been on any cheap or expensive monitor arm I've ever had. I'm not saying all companies are trying to take you for a ride, but what I am saying is... Next time you get a new monitor, try it on its normal foot. And you might you might be surprised. Who knows? Right. I'm gonna carry on with communists for Mars now. Also, quick updates. All of the sub badges, I've changed them to be a logo for the channel, so my face, basically. Because one, I'm a narcissist, and two, why well, I have narcissistic tendencies, and two, um, I don't want to incentivize people subbing, right? So if you sub for a month, you get the same um, badge as if you sub for a year, if you sub for two years, whatever. It's absolutely fine. Also, I've changed the channel points. It used to be called Mana. It's now called Law Nuggets because that's a running theme of this channel. Um, whenever there's a bit of story to be had in a game, I'm like, ooh, delicious Law Nugget. And I didn't realize that was a thing somebody actually pointed that out to me. So. Yeah, so these, um, I'll take a photo of these magnets, but basically they've come, they come packaged in a box. Just all stuck together. They're just all stuck together. I know you all want to hear the keyboard. People like that. So I don't actually have it connected to anything. I was treating myself, way off topic, coming back off uh, the glamping trip after I, uh, had sorted my head out a bit and got myself in a bit of a better mental health space. I treat myself to some new pens and a pen holder. So exciting. Being 12 years old again is very exciting. Uh, and a new book as well, a new notebook. Because the notebooks I do have, it's a wild ride this stream, it's a wild fucking ride. Notebook I do have at the moment, really good, right? But it sits and then on the desk and then it sort of goes like that and then closes. I mean, it doesn't do that. I did a bit of that, don't get me wrong, but it doesn't sit normally. So I got a ring bound one. Firstly, it's bigger. I got a ring bound one so it can sit open and flat on the desk. So this guy's a backup. Not to be confused with my pocket notebook, which is my actual working memory. Thanks, Brian. Um, which never leaves my side. Also, par pens. There you go. Par sharpies. I'm rich, take them. Right, let's sh shut that off. Ooh, that's nice. For comparison. Turn this off. MX keys. Can't really see it because the keying. Actually, I can turn the keying off. 
Oh, I can't turn the keying off because I'll fuck up my game. MX keys, MX keys mini. Oh god, that's even worse. Oh lord. Hey, you sort of get that. You sort of get the impression there. MX keys, MX keys mini. And now, the ultimate test. It is a very good keyboard. It also means that I can have it and my mouse in a position where I'm not going to be straining my arm to reach my mouse past a thingy. <laughs> ticky, 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 ticky. Uh, yes, I'm not going to be straining my arm past my numpad in order to to actually use it. But not, not right now, obviously. So I still have a cup. Right, communist from Mars. This, I wasn't even using my mouse and keyboard. Get these fucking archaic things away from me. I think I am some sort of big, big five head, big brain, more immortal person. No. I'm a smooth brain fucking plaid person. Give me a control pad any day. If it's good enough for space, it's good enough for me. Missile command? Was it called missile command? Oh, we had the big rollerball. Killing it, folks. We are killing it. Wave complete. How's that? There we go. Oh, no. I wasn't paying attention. I was too busy trying to be a big, big streamman. Oh, I missed it. Oh, no. Oh, no. There we go. See, the trick is to kill it before it kills you. What I found. Okay. Wave three. This is kind of done now. I need this to be a bit more exciting. Wave grid. It's the most unimpressed wave clear gratification I've ever heard of. I I take the piss out of this game because it's easy to, but also because I kind of feel like that's not exactly my vibe. But I don't mind taking the piss out of stuff if it's in jest. Like I'm not being overly hurtful. Like I just think. You know, some stuff could have been done better. Like some of the awful bugs we've found. Now don't you don't start dropping nukes on me. Oh I'm out of I'm out of zap power. Low battery. I've got a low battery. Let's go there. Low battery. Oh. Well, I said I wanted it exciting. I was wrong. I don't want to excite anymore. I want boring. One million dead. One million dead. Get that. Wave cleared. Yay. We've only lost a million people. It's fine. I was going to make a COVID reference then. That would be a poor taste, wouldn't it? Sometimes. I wonder if I should just let my intrusive thoughts win. One day, I'll just, I'll just come on stream and just be like, all this really insensitive shit will start flowing from my mouth. And I'll just be like, it's just my intrusive thoughts. It's not an excuse. Genuinely not an excuse. Be a good human fucking being. That's, that's all you gotta do. It's not hard. Millions of people do it every single day. I'm fucked. I'm... Well, they're dead. Eight point six million. There was a lot of uh, well, you have wet clothes waiting for you in the machine. But we've got a goal complete, so that's cool. Hopper's full on race chaser. Nice. Cha ching. Let's empty that hopper. Cha ching. Money in the bank, or rather, money in my pocket. I don't care about any of the washing today. I don't care about the washing. Right. Um. Communists on Mars. That's what we're doing. 
Get a combo of 10. Get a combo? What? Hang on. Is that the right one? Comes combo? Well, we scored a high, a high score. So, yeah, there's that. Cyberdance. What we've got to do is Cyberdance. Hit 1,000 perfect foot beats. Get a combo of 100. I mean, we could probably get a combo of 100. Cyberdance vanilla, right? Not Cyberdance Euro mix. Cyberdance vanilla. Let's see. Oh, it's the sexy fear effect lady. Why does she dance like every dad at a wedding? Maybe I've just gone to some weird weddings. Who knows? Okay, that's not like every dance at a wedding. That's like every mum at a wedding. Oh, that's maybe jokes. Both my parents are dead. I have no frame of reference. One of the many similarities I share with Batman. That and crippling, crippling depression. And anger issues. Goal complete. Yay. Was that the combo goal? I'm assuming that was the combo goal. I'm not looking. How, how picky is this to get perfects? Oh, I fucked it. Oh well, get off. Let Mrs. Motivator do what do what she's doing. Uh, right, Cyberdance. So, yep, yeah, get a combo of 100. Fantastic. Get a thousand perfect bees. Not gonna happen. Wait, a thousand accumulative? Like, you know, like, we don't have to do it in a row, right? Cyberdance Euromix. Hit 500 perfect bees. No, not gonna happen. Empathy. I think we've got all the ones from empathy. Hit 25 thoughts of your. In oh, Jesus, it didn't say that either. Fucking hell. Right, okay. So this is going to be dull for anyone who's not seen this before. But this is this is a game, this is a DLC cabinet that we downloaded a while ago. Um, and basically, it's one of those grab the handles and, and chuck your um, kind of dealios. And this noise in the background that you can hear is awful. Grab handles to begin. Begin your journey. You have clean clothes waiting in the dryer. I know. I don't know if I feel everything. I don't know if this is even going to work, to be honest with you. No, arg. I'm just going to waggle my stick. <laughs> oh, that reminds me, there's a quote bot now. There's only two quotes, but there's a quote bot now. I think if you type an exclamation mark quote, you'll see one of the quotes. <laughs> I'll be honest, I'm not I'm not 100% sure if I've allowed, if I've put any permissions on adding quotes. <laughs> Uh God fucking damn it. Is this reality? Right. Just, uh no it's not. And I've died. Well, that's fucking sucks, isn't it? I'm an idiot. Uh right, twenty-five thoughts in game. That's a real random that's a real mixed bag there. Uh jukebox. Listen to ten music tracks. That can't be can't that can't be that hard. One. Surely that's one, right? Oh my god. Uh, exit. That's, that's two, right? No, it's not. Listen to the jukebox for like three hours. Right. Get me out of here. Does any of that count? Nope, none of that counts. Okay. Let's put... Oh, hello. Sick pup 69 Nice. Welcome to the party. Thank you for uh, following. Right, what do I want to listen to? I don't want to listen to Rave. That's... That's not a bad sound. i got to be honest. What's with this? Oh, it's a bit heart-shaped heart -shaped box for this time. 
Uh, question, what do you need to do to unlock the DLCs? So you need to purchase them. So let me just go empty my token machine. Bear with, bear with. I have them, but I can't get them. So you need to buy them in. So you get to a certain point in the game. So pop. Go to your computer. Okay. I bet that's fucking copyright music as well. Go to arcade imports. So there's on your PC, there's arcade imports, and the, these are all the uh, DLC ones that you've got. As far as I'm aware, anyway, these are all the other arcade imports. Was MP an arcade import? Yeah, MP was an arcade import. So they will be $100. Um, but you'll have to have room for them. So, for example, Vostok Inc. Pinball. I don't know, do I have room for this? No. You don't have enough space for this item. Progress further in the game to be able to purchase DLC caps. So you need the space for them. Because obviously, if you've got five spaces in your uh, arcade and you need five things, um, five arcade machines to progress, you can't fill them up with these. You need to purchase uh, the actual arcade machine ones. But with every upgrade, you get story ones. You have the story done. You should definitely be able to buy them though, from thingy. As far as I'm aware, you should be able to buy them from arcade imports. Although that being said, there are some bugs in this game, so I'm not sure. I'm really... I can't listen to that song. Oh my god, I can't listen to that. That's super annoying. Let's go with Follow the Sun. Now, how, how bad can that be? Um, yeah, there are definitely some bugs, so the DLC's not unlocked. I I don't know, we've not done the story, so I don't know if it locks locks you out once you've done the story. But if you can still access the PC, have a quick look, see if Arcade Imports is there. Because um, otherwise, I, I do not know. Unfortunately, I wish I did, but I don't. Genuinely wish I did. Uh, additional, do these cost pounds? These cost pounds. Not, I can't, I don't, I, I'm not that bothered about the jukebox, I'm sorry. I love music, I'm not that bothered about the jukebox. That music. Maybe it's game goals or popularity. I don't know. Yeah, not sure. It's it's never been a problem buying them. So as soon as I purchased them, uh, as soon as Arcade Mania opened up, maybe, um, I don't know if you can start a new game. I don't know if that's a possibility. You have no, Yeah, exactly. Uh, as soon as Arcade Mania became a thing, as soon as Arcade Mania opened up, Arcade Imports also opened up. Um, no, DLC cabinets will not progress stories. Some cabinets may be unavailable to purchase or place until you progress in the game. So maybe, I don't know, maybe they kind of fucked up with the whole placement of DLC. Maybe they were like, people won't buy the DLC after the game. You have white clothes waiting machine. I know, I don't care. I, can't, I don't care about laundry anymore. So, start the game and then bought it and all the DLCs the next day. Then I do not know what to suggest. I really don't see pop. It sounds like it sucks, to be honest with you. Um, yeah, if I were in that position, maybe restart the game. I don't know. Really don't know. Turn it off and on again. I hope you get it sorted. Uh, what we got? Get a chain. Get a hit chain of thirty. Defeat a thousand guns. You can probably get a chain hit of thirty. That was on King Rush, right? King Fury. Sorry, no King Rush. King Fury. King Fury's. Is this one I have to play, I have to remember I have to play it like a thingy, like a rhythm game, not like a punch up game. Also, every character other than uh, King Fury is garbage. 100% oh, garbage. I'm pressing the button. Oh! <laughs> I found... I found a pro an, an, an error. Error is good. Interesting. Okay, cool. Well, let's Let's try that again, shall we? Hoppers full. There's so many full hoppers. I mean, I'm definitely gonna go empty these first No worries, sick pop. See you later uh, So, some response Oh god, this hopper's so awkward. There we go. And is it stack over for Stack over for Well, bad. There we go. More money. Right, so then they will generate more money. Come on, go, go into that. Kung Fury. Kung Fury. I'll, I'll Kung your Fury. Right, so we come on. Sure. 
What do you mean I missed? Fuck off. Absolutely not. Ridiculous. Utterly ridiculous. Utterly ridiculous. This game, this game is awful. I hate it here and I want to go home. See you later, Bob. Personal best. Fantastic. It still sucks. Put another quarter in. Bam, bam, bam. I keep getting greedy, that's my problem. It's always my problem. I'm not reading that notification because I'll fuck this up. What do you know I missed? Oh, oh, I hate this game. Get I'm out. I'm out. I don't even know what the notification was. I'm out. Uh Lion Terror. What are we gonna do with Lion Terror? Oh my god. Travel for a thousand miles. Complete level with at least eight five percent filled in. Oh, this assumes we haven't played Lion Terror before. We mustn't have played it. God, the save progress system on this game is a bit busted. Lion Terror. Oh, God. Lion Terror. Uh, uh. Can we? Oh, air hockey's full. Got it. Something else is going to be full, isn't it? Something, something else is going to be full. I'm just not sure what. Certainly not that. Certainly not those. Not that. Not that. Not that. No. No, maybe it was the washing. Maybe it was just a washing notification. Who knows? Line terror. Line terror. Don't eat me. Oh, that noise. Oh, Lord, that noise. Right, I just need that stick to go away. I need to not get got by this. No! Oh, I got. I got. Exploded. Oof. Horrible smell of drains coming from outside. Oof. 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 No, I've got to close that window. Oh. Oh. oh, that was awful. Yeah. Smell my neighbor's drains. Jesus. Right, this is dangerous. This is super dangerous. But we're doing it anyway, so. I used to love these games as a kid. Absolutely love them. I mean, in fairness, back in my day, it was this or playing with a rock in the street. So, you know, oh, nearly. Being the oldest man on Twitch has its uh, downsides. Oh, I'm dead. I'm dead. Lives one. Dead. Exterminated. Right, so I've definitely gotten past level one before. Line terror. Get fucked. Go on, sod off. No, no, Stickman Steve. Thank you. Don't follow me down here, that's not allowed. Wow, whoa, whoa, whoa. You've been a fucking beeline for me then, you bastard. Absolute shit. That thing is, that thing is targeting me now. Wah. I hate this, I want to go home. Right, what else we got? Penguin push. What's penguin push? Complete round five. Collect a total of 100 coins. Go for a swim 25 times. Score a total of 250 points. Make 20 walruses. Walruses? Vol vol That's such a hard word to say. Walruses? Red with anger. Okay, let's go for penguin push. Let's hear it, right? Pew. This game was made before audio balancing was invented. Penguin push. Is this? I don't know what this is going to be ripping off. Oh, it's Mario. Of course it is. Boink. 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 
Can I bonk it? Yep. Boink. Did I say collect a total of a hundred coins? What? I almost died. I could have died. Boink. Now, is that going to make you guys unhappy? Yes, it is. I'm going to just make myself scarce. Ah, I'm invincible here. Mostly. Apart from the whole psychotic seabird thing. Go for it seven, ten times. Oh, I see. I, so I can just complete this really easily, right? Bloop. And get vomited up by an orca. Yep. Cool. <laughs> so there's three. Chase is a good a good investment as well. There you go. I need to go do some software analysis. Pow. Pow. Pew. Pew. Cool. That's that fixed. <laughs> I just said I just said someone's like, should I bring my assault rifle? Yeah, wet clothes working machine. I don't care. I'm past carrying at this point. I just want to play games and do arcadey stuff. You know, there's an achievement for not doing anything all day. Like, just literally, t basically turning around and going home. Like, the minute you get out, the minute you get off the bus. And then your, uh, your dad will uh, yell at you. Wait, is this accumulative walruses or not? Yeah, it's accumulative. Good. Boing. So that'll be another three, right? Yeah. Oh, so many angry walruses. Walrus. What weird name, walrus. There's two coins. Whoop. Nearly. The jump button does not work on this very well. Probably to simulate uh, arcade lag. But I don't like it. So it can just not lag. Oh, balls. Oh, balls. Snowballs. No, nine. Did I get a hundred? A hundred quick cards. A hundred coins. Wait, got to have a hundred coins, but that says nine. Oh, is that nine points? Nine gems. Boink. Bump. Level one. Oh, I've got no. I've got no power. Power bop. This music's gonna be seared into my brain. Boink. Whoop. Wah, death. Death and splash. Oh yeah, I forgot about the thing. Forgot about the, wait. It's just count, right? Go for some 25 times. Oh, this, this, I can't, I can't with this music. All my days. What else we got? Roger. Complete level 3, complete level 7, destroy 50 missiles in endless, survive 30 seconds in endless mode. God, we can, we can do that well easy. Probably not. How do you play endless? Oh, I think you unlock endless mode. Got it. Do I crash if I go off the screen? No! I crash if I go into a missile, though. <laughs> lesson learned. Every death is a lesson. That's why this game is the Dark Souls of simulators. Oh. Oh, okay, cool. Yep, skip. I don't care about the story. The one game I don't care about, Lorna Guts. I just want to play the mini games. Well, well done, Roger. Roger. I say this, I'm still waiting. Oh, oh, no. Piss. Well, we fucked that, didn't we? Oh, I missed. I missed the other option there, I don't know what the option was. Zoom. Missile incoming. Oh god! The buttons do stuff as well. <laughs> Apparently they cause lag. Scott's story recap. No, I'm good, thanks. 
Uh, come and think of it. What time is it? It's 20 to 12. I should probably go empty all the machines. I don't give a two about washing. That's all just going to stay there. We're just... We're, uh, this is our villain arc. We're just going to screw off the washing and we're just going to uh, uh, focus on the arcade machines. Because... I'm going to make him lots of money, and then we're going to take over the world. No, stop trying to play Penguin Push. This is synonymous for my life as a content creator. I'm just, I'm constantly like, ah, oh, this is a great business strategy and a great business plan. Ooh, shiny game. <laughs> How do you, there we go. That already had another 220. That is raking in raking in. We need to revisit our um, prices as well uh, to see how much things cost and if we're getting a cost effective price on things. <gasps> 215 from that? Oh my days. You can't see the total at the moment but it's over $3,000 at the moment. Which I think... I can't get Roger's hopper. I can't, why can't I get the hop... There. There. Where was it? There. $15. Oh my god. <laughs> the game is garbage. <laughs> it, w it will be less garbage if I play it as well because then people will, will want to play it more. So we've got 4,360. Here comes the most pointless lock mini game in the world. All you gotta do is just spin it till it zooms in and then press the A button. That's it. There's no nothing else. Right, use computer. Shuttlecocks. Buy shuttlecocks. There we go. And the other one was four thousand three thousand nine hundred ninety nine. Insufficient funds. Why did you let why did you let me buy it then? This it, that's just uh uh what was I gonna say? That's just inconsiderate on your part. Upgrades, we got ninety pounds. We can buy shoes. That's what we can buy, we can buy shoes. What is that? Oh, they'll break down less frequently. So our K games will break down less frequently. We've got uh, I'll just I'll cash in the hoppers and put them in the safes so you don't have to. That's not a bad shout actually. Trendy pair of glasses, got those. Digital safe, open the safe with ease. Uh, art of meditation, pick up less trash, clean the toilet less often, and find other people's gross gum less frequently. Mm. Um, a roadster, open up earlier. Oh, I see. <laughs> Uh, doesn't have any bleepy alerts. Brilliant. Uh, radio advertisement, boost your business fame and thus increase profits. We should probably go for that. Uh, carry twice as much trash in the bag and move like lightning by clicking the left stick. We're going to get those. The sneakers allow you to jog. Cool. They're immediate as well, I believe. Yes, so we now go zoom, which doesn't really feel like a zoom, but it's still a zoom. Uh, and that's us. Zoom. Just like in Pokemon. Just like in Pokemon. You can't run unless you've got the shoes for it. Oh, you you weren't here, I don't think, on developers. When we were talking about Pokemon Blue. When we were talking about um, playing through the original Pokemon Blue again, because I've got... Uh, so I've got an analog. There's, God, I'm, I'm having to hop back in the trains of my train of thought here. Um, so there's a company called Analog that do new retro tech, and they do Super Nintendo. I was like, what the fuck have I bought? Shortcuts. Um, they do new retro tech, and basically they do a. Oh, oh, that might be our last one. Oh no, we've got the thingy to buy, haven't we? Um, so they do a retro Super Nintendo console. So what I've got is I've got that, um, and I've got uh, a Super Game Boy as well. So I'm one step closer to being able to actually play um, the original Gen 1 Pokemon, which is obviously the best Gen Pokemon because it was the one I was raised on. But, I mean, that's, that's just a fact. Everyone knows that. But, yeah, that's an interesting thing. Cool story, right? Anyway, so what we're we doing? Uh, we could pick up trash, which we're going to because I don't like trash and it earns us money. It earns us a little bit of money. And people won't come here if they... Uh, Nuzlocke? Nuzlocke? Is that what that's taking a piss out of? 
Is that while that's modeled on? Where did I even put it? Oh, it's there. Is it this? Oh my god, this machine's massive. Is this Pong? This is Pong. I can't help but feel that <laughs> at this point of the game. It's a good filter though. Rip my frame rate, but it's a good filter. No one is going to be able to... Oh, I, I lost. Oh. No one is going to be able to see this because it's going to be absolutely horrendously artifacty. Uh, what's the things on this? Like shuttlecocks. Win a game with shuttlecocks at match point. Defeat the AI player without conceding a goal. Complete 10 rounds and defeat the AI player three times. I mean, we will. I just don't think that grainy effect is going to do the, do the stream any good. Um... More trash, maybe? Oh, I forgot we have a zoom. Let's enhance. No, we've got ghost orbs, apparently, flying across the screen. Uh, nope. No more gum in here. No more gum on here. No, no gum in here. No gum in here. No, nope. we've got this massive newspaper that I missed. Attention to detail. You have clean clothes waiting. I know I have clean clothes waiting in the washer. I've completely lost interest in laundry. This is what happens when I take the time off. It's additional rules you can make up to make the Pokemon games more challenging. You can only catch the first Pokemon on each route. If Pokemon faints, you release it. You need to name each Pokemon to build a better bond with your team. I mean, I do, I do always do that last part anyway, to be honest with you. <laughs> Normally, anyway. I like that. If a Pokemon faints, you release it. So, like, it, that's almost like it dies, sort of thing. <laughs> Basically. Which uh, leads me very nicely to when I played Pokemon Cursed Black Edition, which I spent fucking forever editing and playing and has done no traffic. <laughs> Basically, you had a you had a ghost that could just do uh, one move, which was uh, curse. And then you heard the cry of the Pokemon, and then the Pokemon disappeared. And then at the end of the fight, when you were talking to the trainer, it was like, go, curse trainer. And then the trainer's sprite would just disappear from the game world. It was fucking creepy, man. Absolutely creepy in the bin um what i am tempted to do before i start playing because i haven't even I haven't even looked up how much friggin pokemon blue is um and it has to be pokemon blue unfortunately because that's the one i had when i was younger although you know charmander slash charizard is the best um i would really like to play pokemon uh, on emulator with crowd control which means people in Twitch, in the land of where you are, you, not you, you, the one behind you, you, they, you, can control what happens in the Pokemon game with points. And these points are generally free, to be honest with you. Or oh, I'll set everything to the minimum so we can just have a bit of fun. A little bit similar to the um, Spooky's Jump Scare Mansion that we played, which was ridiculous. Gumi is life, Gumi is love. I'll, I won't, I'm not taking anything away from that. I don't understand that reference. Oh, what's today's things? Score 100 alarm a game. Or get 100 score in alarm a game. Collect 2500 in race chaser and destroy 10 missiles in Roger. We can do all of those. Let's do Roger first. Oh no, Roger's the. Uh... Oh, it's a reference. Oh right, yeah. <laughs> it's a reference to Twitch Plays Pokemon. I remember that reference. Yum. Ten missiles in Roger. Roger was not the one I was thinking of. I thought it was uh, communist on Mars we were thinking of. So convenient that it just goes goes through like that. I'm playing a dangerous game here. I'm playing a dangerous game. But yeah, it would be basically like Twitch Plays Pokemon. I would play it, but you guys would... Fuck you, Missile Man. 
I would play it, but you guys would have direct influence in what happens. Like, give player this HM, or make Pokemon faint, and stuff like that. And then you just redeem points in chat, and it would happen live through an interface, through a, an overlay. I hate this game. I hate this game when I'm trying to talk. I can't talk in game at the same time, which is why I'm a Twitch streamer. <laughs> uh, right, Razor Chaser. Winners don't do drugs. Don't forget, kids. Winners don't get caught doing drugs. So you got to remember it. 2,500. Get absolutely shit on. No. Nope. I'm not having that. No. Nope. I'm not having that at all. Yum. I always forget that I need to use the mini-map, not the actual screen, to play this. Because otherwise I can't play it. 2,500. There we go. That's that done. Race Chaser, lovely, lovely. Uh, Llama Game. Oh my god. Talk to yourselves for a minute. <laughs> oh no, this is the game that last time I had to concentrate so hard and I was asking chat not to make any not to make any noise. That's the most popular my chat has ever moved. Like, ever. <laughs> oh yeah, a thousand? Jeebus. Fuck! Can they hear next door's kids just trying to kill each other? <laughs> I'd like to say I wasn't like that with my sister when we were growing up, but we probably were. Fuck. This is insane, isn't it? So how's your Tuesday been, chat? <laughs> oh, I need to ask um, a question of chat. Uh, this is a random question, but... Uh, concentration music. Talk to me about concentration. What music do you listen to when you need to really concentrate on work or a task or whatever you're doing? And I'm not saying like cleaning up or anything like that. I mean like you're sat at a desk, you're using a keyboard and you need to zone out. I need to know like what music do you listen to? Do you normally have an artist? Do you normally have a vibe? Do you normally have a genre? That sort of thing. Talk to me. Talk to me about music. I want to know what you. I want to know what goes in your ears. Tell me what goes in your ears, chat. I want to know. I mean, I won't be able to look until I get the score, but it'll make for good, make for good engagement. <laughs> Hup. Come on, you shit. Llamas are normally. I'm normally like llamas quite a lot, and I hate this llama so badly with my compassion, because it's just. Every every single pixel I saw out of the corner of my eye then underscore un underscore undertail uh OST. That's a that's a solid shout. Have you heard the um Game Shops remix? The Game Shops remix is phenomenal. Absolutely phenomenal. I'm never getting a thousand if I don't concentrate. That's that's why I that's why I understand here. I'm not, I'm not doing it. I'm just not doing it. My brain my brain's not in this right now. It's really not in that. It's not in that at all. Um right, what are we doing? Pick up that sock. You fucking animal. Uh okay. So yeah, Undertale OST. Good shit. I listen to um Bad Sector. It's a band called Bad Sector. I got into Bad Sector because um I played a game called Signalis, and the music in Signalis is well weird. Um, so I wanted to know who did the music for it. God, I need a fucking shave. I need to go to the barbers. Um, it, it's growing sentience now, like my beard. My beard no longer grows long, it just grows thick. And like I lose my, I lose my hand in it. Um, and I... Yeah, I wanted to know who made the OST for Signalis. Turns out that it's just a random collection of noises and sounds. But bands similar to them are Bad Sector. And there's a very good album of theirs called Storage Disc 3, which was just... At the at the time I found that, I was literally making a network storage for myself. And I'm like, 
that fits. I'll listen to this. And it's just such a weird... You have to listen to it with good headphones on. Not like good, good headphones. Don't, don't like buy new headphones. But like both both headphones, if you've got them, or both earplugs, and just no other distractions. It's just so trippy, so weird. Um, Boards of Canada as well. I'm a big fan of Boards of Canada. Uh, I had to double check I wasn't wearing my Boards of Canada t-shirt then. Um, if I had to focus, I listen to Jump for My Love by the Pointy Sisters on repeat, which I realise is a tell me your neurodivergent without telling me your neurodivergent thing. <laughs> Do you know what my um, particular uh, uh, song stim of choices at the moment? And it has been for probably six years. Uh, Bob on Battlefield from Super Mario 64. Lives in my head rent free, and you're all fucking welcome that it's now taking up residence in yours. Uh, right. What were we on? We've done Roger. Oh, we'd had a look at Roger. Not a big fan of that. I'll go behind. Racer Chaser, we literally cannot do all three levels. Can't, wait, hang on. Two out of three. We haven't done two levels. Hang on a minute. Come here. Come here. What's this? New Casa. Right. Crime City. Oh, now I don't know which one I've done. Let's see. Let's try and do Crime City. Oh. You have wet clothes waiting. I know. And they're gonna they're gonna stay wet. They're gonna stay waiting. Oh, I don't know. It'd be really nice if I knew which which cities I've done. Oh dead. Oh lord! Yeah, my, uh, my. I've also now, because I've uh, got a working memory again, because I've finally refound my notebook. Um, I have created a kitchen vibes playlist, which consists of two songs, because <laughs> that's all that goes through my head when I'm cooking. <laughs> two. Oh, I fucked it. Oh, go away. Go away. Go away. I'm glad they can't shoot me. Like, I'm super glad they can't shoot me. Let's go to the car. Get to the Lambo. See you later, suckers. Boink. Ah, this is going to be real awkward if we've done this city. I don't remember doing this city. I don't remember the beach. I think I would have made a... You fuckers. I think I would have made a Vice Beach reference. If I'd have seen that beach. Oh my god, I'm going to die. I busted. Uh, I dead. I dead. What's the other one? So we're a crime city. Go away. No, also a crime city. New Casa. Esu Casa. Ooh, Night City. Maybe we haven't done Night City. Because that seemed quite hard to get, that. I'm willing to bet we haven't done Night City. And it's not like this... i got to stop looking at the fucking screen. i got to start using the mini-map. Oh, my days. Oh, my days. I am such a silly boy. Oh, are you dead? No. Yeah, apparently you were. Oh, no. Yep, no. Okay, let's go this way. No. Now we get out. I got an appointment. I gotta go. Bye. Zoom. Zoom. <laughs> See those suckers? You're yeah, clean clothes right in the dryer. Don't give a shit. Don't, don't care. It's just like in real life. <laughs> just gonna stay there i honestly uh one of the things i need to remind myself of on a daily basis is have i left clothes in the dryer it literally i was saying a couple of sessions ago that i could really honestly do with these pop-ups that happen on this screen every now and then where it's just like don't forget you got clothes in the washing machine oh, 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 oh. you're right i do Right, why is that pink car just sat there? Oh, it's bugged. Oh, no. Why is... Oh, there's more pips down here. Oh, my God, I'm going to die. There we go. There we go. Oh, there's loads. I've got bloody loads of them, haven't I? I've hardly done any. 
Fortunately, I've broken Pinky, which is you know, the most aggressive of them. Oh, the red one, you can just absolutely get chuffed on. Right, come here. No, go back. There, this way. No, uh, absolute. Fuck off. Fuck off. I've only got three pips to get. Get off me. I will slap you with my boombox. Uh, it's a saying I've not said for a while. Oh, God. Go away. Go away. No. Oh, you, you get so aggressive. So aggressive. All of you. Just fuck right off. The lot of you. You, you red dickhead. You are just... Uh, you've got no right being faster than me. And my cars have no right being the opposite way to where I'm running all the time. Run. Run. Oh, no. I could have sworn I got that. Right, well, that that can get in the bin, can't it? Uh, right, what else have we got? Shortcocks. Probably not going to happen. Smoke them. Get 100 points in one round. Shoot 12 shots without missing and clear a grid within two seconds. Oh my god. Disable flash. Yes, thank you. Oh my god. This I think this is going to be actually easier with a mouse. Or not. There we go. Goal complete. I don't know what goal complete is. Screwed that. Oh, no, I died. Oh, no, I didn't die. I just lost the life. Okay. That was good, I think. 146. I think that was good. We got all of them. Excellent. <laughs> wow. God damn. <laughs> all right. Next. Space... Space Race Simulator. I don't really like Space Race Simulator. Boost. I don't like Space Race Simulator because I don't like racing games. I've got to be honest. It's not a. It's not a thing. Um, but we'll we'll go have a go. Uh, let's leave. Thank you. Let me go. Space Race Simulator. I don't think it matters what I listen to. Is it just what button is it? Tell me. Tell me the button. Tell me. How do how do go? It's right trigger. Of course it is. Right, hang on. How do you play? First, select a song. And once race starts, use left and right trigger to accelerate and left trigger to brake. Braking while it's turning will initiate a drift boost and give you extra acceleration. Okay. Well, I think I got to like 400, so 400 kilometers, kilometers. So I'm interested, for people who don't normally... Wait, that's not the sentence I wanted. <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot this has got some really strong Simon Stalinhog vibes to it, hasn't it? With these machine, this machinery. I'd be stunned if the developer of this is not aware of his art. Oh, 
race chaser hoppers for. Um, what was I going to say? Uh, well, guys, Avenger has broken down. No! We've been playing this for a while now, and I'm interested to know, people who watch the channel a lot, do you care if it's one game? Do you care if it's multiple games, different game every stream? Do you want to watch a game to completion? I'm interested. Let me know. Let me know what you think. Get in the comments. I don't know where... Oh, bollocks. Where I'm going. But I'm going there really fast. I would watch Pokemon to completion. I would watch Pokemon to completion. Good. Good. Nicely said. Nicely repeated. Developers. Like, if we play Pokemon, 100% completion. Don't don't get me wrong. But, like, so this game, I feel like I got the gist of this game. This is this game has been fun. Do not get me wrong. Games like this, I feel like, um... I don't... What? Did we, did we even do anything then? We... Did not. Excellent. Oh, 420 kilometers. Uh, yeah, so games like this, um, I'm just wondering if in future we would uh, play games like this to completion or not. Uh, I don't care either way, don't even care if a game is finished most of the time. I tend to lose interest in a game long before the story is done and go watch random YouTube nonsense more often than not. That's fair. So I'm thinking, there's a reason, there's a reason I'm asking this. Also, firstly, uh, a rude note, welcome, thank you for much tuning in. Um, I have been having some thoughts <laughs> and my neurodivergent, spicy neurodivergent brain has decided, I'm like, I might just want to stream spooky games for a while, just for a bit, like, just for a bit, like, spooky, indie spooky games, big spooky games, apparently my frames are dropping, who knew, I didn't, I got a big red line, a big red light on OBS, um, and I'm thinking long-form games like this might be uh, either a future thing or an offline thing. So I might do it as a series on YouTube. Uh, oh yeah, well, Gala just spoken. Or I might do it just occasionally do a game like this. Oh, you got them jump back to like oh, jump to like 140 <laughs> FPS for a moment and then back to 90. Stop stealing my frames. I've asked you before. Stop stealing my frames. Uh, right. Okay. Management. So yeah. So I don't know. I think because I I have a, a tendency to do a thing for a few weeks and then be like, this clearly isn't working because I'm, it's not immediately successful. Therefore, I'm going to completely destroy it and change the way I'm doing things. I need to not do that. But I also need to think to myself, how can I sort of double down on this niche thing like i'm enjoying this and i'm enjoying what i think would be periods of uh spooky games with the occasional kind of long form chill game like this i think that's probably what's going to happen it's not definite so don't get me wrong um but it, it feels like what's it feels like how it's going to go make it to day 14 without being fired that's not that's not, that's not possible Strike gold. Dig down to 500 meters. Destroy 5,000 watts. Post all of good. Pick up through. None of those are easy. We nailed all of those last time. Whoops. UFO assault. Destroy 500 building floors. Building floors. Beat wave for three. Three, three, three. And finish a wave while at the lowest altitude. It's <sighs> big yawn for you. Big yawn for you. Uh, I keep it at 1440p ultra with everything on because my monitor is 75 fps but now and then it finds some frames or something it spikes and it's weird well that's fair enough I like when that happens well I do and I don't I would like to play games at a higher frame rate and resolution but I don't normally play a lot of games here oh fuck I need to go into that oh no race chase was full wasn't it as well Ching. Was air hockey full as well? Because that's pretty popular. No. Um, I forgot what I was saying. Uh, 
Unvelbu says, for me, rechanging stuff slash trying out new stuff, I got confused by name change slash disappearance of lo-fi gaming, and that's why I haven't been around. It took me until now to realize lo-fi is just not called that right now. Yeah, yeah, I think I'm confusing people with having multiple YouTube channels. I think what's going to happen, right? This definitely won't make the YouTube cut. Right. <clears throat> so I think what's going to happen is... So I've got the specific YouTube channels that I think, you know, because YouTube likes variety, YouTube likes niche, Twitch likes variety, right? I think what I'll do way beforehand, way beforehand um, on Discord, it's what I was doing, let me see if I can get this right, what I was doing, um, uh, I just like it because it means I'm leaving performance on the table someplace and wonder where it went to, that's fair enough. Uh, what I was doing was I was having all of my content go straight from Twitch to the peripheral mic YouTube channel. Now what I'm doing is I've got specific days for stuff. So normally, this game aside, normally Mondays are horror games, Fridays are lo-fi games, right? And then I'll fit retro games in whenever I can because those are my three main niches that I love. Now I think what I'm doing is I'm kind of over-niching the Twitch uh, formula a little bit. So what I'm trying to do... What I've noticed is if I play a horror game on a Friday, for example, it actually gets more engagement. If I play a chill game on like a Saturday, that gets more engagement. And when I say engagement, I just mean like max viewers, I mean people following, I mean people subscribing, that sort of thing. And that's, at the minute, that's the push, right? That's the push so I can do this more, that's the push so I can do this more um, seriously, basically. Without me trying to say like, oh, I'm incentivizing it and you need to subscribe, like, subscribe and share, that sort of stuff. I'll do those cutaways, I'll do those calls to action on the YouTube stuff. But I think what's probably going to happen now is I will put all of the Twitch stuff on the separate YouTube channels. But I won't have set days of themed days on Twitch. I'll just have... I am streaming on this day. And then on Discord, what I'll do, probably the day beforehand or something like that, is I'll be, oh, I'm in a lo-fi mood, or I'm in a spooky mood, or stuff like that. And then I'll stick on Discord, oh, tomorrow's stream is probably going to be Phasmophobia, right? Tomorrow's stream is probably going to be um, Bear and Breakfast, that sort of thing. So that's probably what I'll start doing. Instead of having, like, um, uh, this specific day is this specific stream and this specific day is this specific stream. Uh, I think that just over complicates things a little bit. I'll get it. I'll, I'm I'm new to doing it properly and I'll get it. I just I need to find a, a vibe and a, a groove that's good for me, to be honest with you. That works. Because then people will come, like there are already people here, right? I don't know how many people are here, but there are already people here. So people will come to that as long as I'm comfortable with it and I just need to I need to find what I'm comfortable with. The problem being as well is I compare myself to others a lot. So I watch a lot of bigger YouTubers and bigger Twitch streamers and I'm like, yeah, so if I do that, I can do that and this and that. And then I remember like, this person has an editor and this person has a social media manager and this person is one person. And the people I watch who are one people are doing it full time, whereas I'm not. I've got a day job, you know, so I can only do stuff in the evening and I'm also trying to juggle a... Uh, social life and um, all the hobbies as well. He says, glancing over to his his Lego stuff that he's not done <laughs> in like a year. <laughs> but I'll get it. I'll, I'll... But I didn't realise, um, Bruce specifically, I didn't realise that you uh, thought Lo-Fi Gaming had sort of disappeared, if that makes sense. So Lo-Fi Gaming has its own bespoke YouTube channel now. <clears throat> Excuse me, YouTube channel now. And when I do uh, lo-fi gaming on Twitch, it's normally, I do normally call it lo-fi gaming, but I just don't do it on um, YouTube anymore. So I don't, I'm not streaming on YouTube. I don't like the platform. I don't think it's any good. Um, the integration's awful. The chat moderation's bobbins. And I'm an affiliate as well. So it means that I, oh, so I can't, I can't get this now, can I? Oh, I can. Excellent. Um, I'm an affiliate on Twitch, so I can't stream on YouTube. I can't, well, I can, but I can't stream on YouTube and Twitch at the same time. And I don't want to split my streaming like I'm splitting my um, uh, video content. And I can't remember who it was who raised it in chat a while ago that, what am I even aiming for? Shit, what am I doing? Beatwave 3, cool. 
Um, I can't remember who raised it in chat, but they were like, I don't like when people have multiple YouTube channels for every niche. And that's totally fair. I, if I could, I wouldn't do that. But my growth on YouTube has just stagnated completely with the, uh, the peripheral mic channel. It's just utterly, utterly gone. Um, it's totally plateaued. However, that being said, the growth on the Lo-Fi Gaming channel has stalled. The growth on the Screen Bear Joypad channel has stalled. But I'm probably going to give that a set amount of time and then see if it works. Because, like, if it works, it works. And if it doesn't, it doesn't, right? The thing that's going to be consistent through that is the thing I want to grow, which is the Twitch channel. Um, and this is the this is the bit I want to... Ooh, lots of tall buildings. This is the bit I want to... Uh, um, I want to grow more. This is the bit where people say, like, I don't want to watch multiple YouTube channels for the same person's content. A hundred percent. Hard agree, right? Hard agree. So just watch the Twitch channel. Like, that's my suggestion. Is That's where this is. This is the source. Doesn't matter where that content goes. This is the source. And the, all the other content, I kind of see it as that's advertising for this source. Um, and if it's in multiple places, in multiple niches... Then that means people who go on and uh, go on to YouTube and search for, uh, oh, I really like horror games, or I really want silly jump scares, or give me, a, I don't know, what was a horror game we played recently? Give me a night delivery playthrough. Um, hopefully, because it's niche, that video will be recommended higher. That video will then encourage people to come to the Twitch channel to hang out in chat. Which means I'll get my 75 um, average viewer uh, threshold met and I'll be able to apply for partnership. Which will be cool, right? Oh, I probably should have bombed that building. This is going to be a close call. It's not going to be a close call. It's not going to be a close call at all. I was that close to getting that achievement then. You bastard. Right, well, we'll do that. Wait, hang on, what time it is it? Oh, it's an opposite, that's fine. Um, oh, it was me. I won't catch. I won't watch them or follow them. If YouTube's keep the crap up, I'll just stop watching it like at the TV. That's fair enough. There's part of me that's like, I've, I've produced a lot of content now, and I'm wondering if it would have been better. Hindsight's 2020, right? I'm wondering if it would have been better just to make playlists on my main channel. <laughs> Which is fucking bonkers, right? <laughs> Because now I'm doubting myself. I'm doubting my decision. But, I mean, it does work to a certain extent. I mean, at the minute, I'm not... Uh, because of time constraints and stuff like that, and just I don't want to exhaust myself, I'm not editing as much as I was. Um, because when I was, I was making myself ill. And I'm like, I didn't do this to just edit videos all the time. I love editing videos, don't get me wrong. I'm a video editor, but... I did this to grow the Twitch channel and I want to play games and have fun with chat. I want to engage with the community. Um, good, I shouldn't die. Uh, I don't want to be constantly making YouTube videos. Uh, I don't mind making YouTube videos, but I don't want to constantly be doing it. But that means that when I'm not making them, they're not getting published. When they're not getting published, they're not getting pushed out. When they're not getting pushed out, my discoverability goes down. So it's a horrible, horrible cycle. I think I've left that too late. I think I've left this too late. I think I'm going to crash into this building. Ah! Bollocks. I hate this game. This game is on this month's Humble Bundle thingy. Fantastic. Hello, Katniss. How are you? Uh, UFO Assault. Air Hockey, we've got all on. Vostok 2093. Vostok 2093. Vostok 2093? Have we played this yet? What is Vostok 2093? I'm in the process of becoming a GOG.com uh, affiliate as well. So at some point, you'll be able to uh, type in exclamation mark game. Oh, it's Gallagher. Um, exclamation mark game and see my affiliate link. And um, if you want this game and you buy it, I get a nice little kickback, which is lovely. Oh, I can just press and hold. I don't need to... I don't need to spam the button. <laughs> Gone are the days of button spamming, eh? Oh, God. Uh, 
Yeah, I, I get what you mean, Arudno. I, I think once you... I think there is a free phone. Free phone? Free phone? <laughs> Spam is delicious. The juicy, juicy law nuggets, Arudno. Uh, I think there's a free form. Um, oh, there's a boss. I think there's a free mode. Free phone? Free phone? Free phone? Free form. Free from? It's a brand of... Uh, food in the UK. For any reason. I don't know if it's just the UK, actually. Oh, God. It's turned into bullet hell. I don't like it. Oh, God. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. Unsubscribe. Unsubscribe. Ha <laughs> ha Go fuck yourself. <laughs> I've softlocked you, dickhead. Nah. Give me your money. Right, what are we... Right, so we've got the hang of this now. Uh, what are we doing? <laughs> Buy all ship upgrades. Complete all levels in... All levels in one zone! Complete away without taking any damage. <laughs> it's never gonna happen. Uh, complete stage of Vostok 2093 without killing any enemies except the boss. Uh, how much? Oh my god, that's so much money. Max health, cool. I buy, oh my god, buy all upgrades. Is this... Does this persist now? Let me see. I don't know if this persists. Oh, it does persist. My money persists and everything. Okay, cool. Well, that's not too bad. Don't think I can. Uh, and everyone just said the whole thing about spam being bad. I mean, it's not the best thing ever, but it's not... Horrible. It's... It's from a, a very poor background uh coming from a very poor background as a child spam's not that bad um what am i even looking at what am i looking at i'm looking at woodgow jr i hate woodgow jr i hate woodgow jr because it's very very hard to see when i need to swap directions for the things for the trees so let's just go over to Wilgo Jr. I'll show you exactly what I mean. So as you can see, you need to use the left and right sticks in order to chop wood. Uh, however, you need to do it quick enough so you don't want to have energy and die. But you also need to do it precise enough so that... 69! Nice! Your thing as a kid was tinned luncheon meat. Tinned luncheon meat. Oh my days. I was introducing our French friend to um, the other luncheon meat with the egg in it. I don't remember that. That might be a UK thing, I'm not sure. That's a tall tree. It is a tall tree. <laughs> nice. Oh, but you do it too often in one direction and that happens. Ah, bonk. It's always the bonk that gets you. Yeah, I was introducing my uh, French uh, friend to uh, lunch meat with egg in the middle, and she was like, why is that a thing? I was like, because it, it was. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. None of us do. Like, you could always tell the rich kids at school because they always had, like, the teddy bear-shaped meat in their, uh, in their sandwiches. Like, why is your, why is your meat shaped in your sandwich? I don't, I don't, I don't get that. A bit like a bird chirping. Oh, it does actually. Ah! Billy Bear sausage. That was it. <laughs> Billy Bear sausage. Right. I've now realised what my uh, my most engages in the community. Oh fuck. Soon, because uh, I've been doing this uh, pretty constantly now for a pumpkin shaped Halloween version. Did they really? Oh my God. Don't let Billy bear his sausage. <laughs> oh fuck. Spam fried egg cheese in English muffin is a great breakfast when you're late for school. And it was my thing on the way to school before McMuffins existed. That's basically a McMuffin. To be honest, that's a Spam McMuffin. That's a McS McSpamming. McSpuffin? No, that doesn't work. <laughs> No, self think before talking. <laughs> Nobody, nobody's loving a McSpuffin. 
No, I thought that was building closed then. Everything's fucking broken in this place. Fix this. Da 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 da. It's buffing. Deep fried puffins in a bun. Fuck it out. Google's what an English muffin is. That's what I'm sat on. That's what an English muffin is, baby. Um, what did it say was full? So, oh, that's nearly full. Uh, are you full? Oh, it's be racer chaser. There, it's always racer chaser. Uh, <laughs> what are we playing? We're Gal Junior. That's what we're playing. Did we get any close to any of them? Get a high score of 111. Bonk your head 66 times. <sighs> Chop a total of 2,000 logs. Let's see. All right, come on. Fuck! I hate this game. I hate this game. Why did I do that? I thought you were home. <laughs> I am home. I know I'm tra I'm trapped in a box somewhere. I'm trapped in a storage container. Just make the content funny, man. Fuck! That's what I was saying. I was saying over the past... I was saying Woodgow Jr. needs to fucking get sold. Uh, over the past probably number of weeks... Oh, this is broken too. I... I've been getting on board with like how Twitch does business, if that makes sense. It's fucking horrendous, but how sort of like discoverability works and how... Um, your stream gets into the eyeballs of other people and stuff like that and it's all crazy it's all like oh the number of people talking in chat it means your discoverability goes up it's one of those like you know when you get a video game and it's like oh there's a secret counter behind this metric like this relationship counter there's a secret counter behind this and you're just like well i'm never gonna learn this am i it's a bit like that it's basically a secret ending that you don't know about that you'll you never get told how to do but when you do it you might get told you've done it if that makes sense we could there's loads of stuff i'm surprised honestly i'm honestly surprised people don't know more about this so it's it's how uh it runs off of if I get this right, how often people talk, the number of uh, uh, unique views, and how often people talk, the number of messages, um, the number of emotes used in chats, the number of, oh god, what else was it? Don't do this, right? The number of, um, I'm sorry, well, stop, time out, time out. You are drinking mango flavored Pepsi. What? <laughs> Mango flavored Pepsi. That sounds remarkably similar to a drink I had in uh, Germany. And I can't remember what it is, but it's basically Fanta and uh, Pepsi um, uh, combined. Also, my dog's anal gland abscess is ruptured today, which was fun because I didn't know she had one. Pet ownership. Pet ownership. Hard relate. Hard relate. One of our cat's pancreases has decided to uh, just stop working basically so we're just like well shit we don't really know what's going on but and he's his medication makes him sick so many trips to the vet here and there i am completely in sympathy of your uh, your your current situation bruce uh what was i saying yeah it, it's weird the discoverability of streams obviously the more viewers you have um 
means the more people see your show because you go higher up that you know there's a, there's a big block of people with zero views and then you get people like 1 to 20 and then it's like 50 to 100 or something like that 20 to 50 50 to 100 that sort of thing and then it caps out i think it caps out like 250 plus so if you have the same discoverability if you have 250 viewers as you do if you have 2 million viewers that's just the same and i think it's at that point i think it's at the 100 viewer plus mark that your discoverability mean includes going onto the front page of twitch i can't fully remember that but yeah it's lots of stuff don't do this but it's also to do with how many bits are uh donated in chat so that increases your discoverability it's a secret ticker that just keeps going how long you've been on for uh, how many times you've streamed that week all of this stuff is all accumulated it's bonkers how much data is harvested because you i think you know being a, a lay person i would just be like play games make friends no there's loads of stuff behind it absolutely loads and i think because i've been so kind of encased in that over the last few weeks i'm like uh, yeah no i'm i'm not i'm enjoying this but i'm constantly sort of thinking about the numbers i'm playing the numbers game mason what do the numbers mean um that's the worst impression worst impression um but yeah i think because I'm, I'm doing that quite often i uh i sometimes sort of zone out a little bit but that'll pass in about a week or so that'll absolutely pass to be honest with you the data from one week of streaming is something like 45 pages of print house if it was all put on paper on oh, at least do you know there's something like um was it oh, i can't remember how many people stream a week or stream a month but there was there was a, an astonishing number of people streaming. Someone on YouTube requested their data and printed out for the lols. <laughs> They're like Pokemon. You collect them and then give them nicknames and sometimes they fight. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, people... Like obviously, lurking. I'm a big fan of lurking. I do that in, in, in friend streams. I do that. Like, if I'm at work, I'll be in at least three streams. Like, there's absolutely no problem with that because it's on a completely separate system. Uh, I will let people know that I'm lurking. Using the, if they've got a lurk command, I'll let them know. Take up the battle! Um, but yeah, it's one of those things. It's a, it's a really weird thing. That's why if you go on to... So next time you're watching Twitch, if you go on to a stream that has, let's say, 100 to 200 views, if you see how they are surreptitiously engaging with chat not just the but not just the organic stuff not just like you just look without saying a single word that's fine Camus. that's always welcome that's genuinely always welcome i'm never going to incentivize this stuff but i think it's an interesting information to have i think it, next time you go to a stream with one two hundred people in um that person may or may not be aware of it but you'll see it and you'll start to recognize it that the streamer will start to ask questions of people and i do that i don't have a low command sorry Catmas. i will do soon i haven't got one up yet um i was too busy changing other very important things like all my subscriber badges to one icon and also my channel points to lore nuggets um <laughs> which feels a bit more on brand i gotta be honest but i am um, yeah that yeah can i get a this in chat can we get a that in chat that sort of thing they're driving oh it's past 2 a.m fuck <laughs> see this is what happens when we just chill out i can't even collect the money <laughs> go just go home that's fine yeah can we do this in chat can we do that can we give so so and so a shout out that sort of thing my look would be hey get out of my window creep <laughs> If I was stream, my lurk command would be, hey, get out of my window, creep. <laughs> but I don't mind, like, people lurking. Like, I remember the days. I've done, done lots of days, uh, lots of streams with zero viewers. I've talked to the abyss, like, constantly. I'm very comfortable with it. Oh, the toilet's blocked. Goody. Um, and having people there and knowing people are there. That's why ages ago, I, I stopped looking at the number of people on stream. Like, the number of viewers, I completely sacked it off. I genuinely never have a clue how many people are there. I do when I first start, because I'm putting in chat commands and I'm changing stream information and all that sort of MacGuffins. But let's find the sweet spot and plunge. Oof. Got it. Critical damage. 
The current number is a non-zero amount. That could be literally anything, and I appreciate you for saying that. Uh, as someone who works with numbers, completely appreciate that. <laughs> it is an integer. Because <laughs> I'm assuming it's not above like 250 something. Um, I can't remember how high ints go now. Oh no. Oh, they're going to revoke my developer card. <laughs> they're just, they're going to sack, they're going to oust me from the Software Testing Association. No. I'm going to be, they're going to tear down my statue in front of the Software Testing Headquarters. <laughs> <laughs> that easy. I'm a paranoid schizophrenic. However, I do not want a camera on me with even three random people staring at me. Lots of people aren't comfortable with it. Lots of people definitely aren't comfortable with it. And I, I've said this a lot that I, I um, uh, I want to recreate that feeling. I remember sat round playing games with friends and it being like a very social experience and it's always a social experience when it happens but i like playing games for an audience and it's, that's i don't i don't mind admitting that it's taken me a long time to say that i, I that's what i enjoy about it i don't want to grab the washing i want to grab the, the the burger box but you know when you were sat around playing games with friends it was a very social experience you could chat you could talk about random stuff you could enjoy the game you could all react together about stuff i want this to be you know chat and mike play this game together not just hey random bunch of internet strangers i mean if the channel gets big enough there are there is always going to be a number of internet strangers on there but i want it to be you know quite a, i'd like it to be quite a strong community i'd like to build something quite nice I think I'm just looking for a legacy, to be honest with you. And maybe my community could be my legacy. Who knows? Maybe we could all do something great together. Like maybe we could change the world. Not sure how, but maybe we could. Who knows? I can't help it. I'm in a great mood recently. Like over the last couple of days, I've been in an absolutely phenomenal mood. Um, because I went and sat in a field for three days. <laughs> My wife realized I wasn't doing so well, so she ordered me to sit in a field for three days. Um, obviously, you know, with shelter and food and drink, uh, lots of bacon sandwiches and beer and stuff like that. But yeah, my, uh, my mental health has perked right up. Absolutely right up. Mm. Any more trash? Any more trash? No. Uh, da -da -da -da. I'm missing all of chat. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Get yourself a VTuber style avatar. I've seen those a lot. And I know I, I actually know people who no longer do face cam and now do VTuber stuff because it's easier. They don't have to. Like, I think they're, they're, I'm not going to name them because they're a friend. But I think their reason was I don't have to. Um, well, there was two. One was I don't have to tidy up. And two was I don't have to dress nice. And I'm like... That's fair enough. <laughs> That's absolutely fair enough. He's not watching us. Let's misbehave. No, don't don't misbehave. Not like last time. I was cleaning up chat emotes for weeks after that. Um, right, I'm gonna have to empty all these hoppers. We didn't do them last night, which means they're probably all pretty full. Uh, and he, oh, that hopper's empty. Oh, that hopper's that's broken. That's why. Stop. Ooh. Uh, I'd be paranoid if it glitched, etc. I don't even like talking to people too often mostly because i hear voices texts i hallucinate uh text i hallucinate much less often that's fair i think i was partially hallucinating text then sorry was it yourself i know who recommended schizophrenia something like that to me everyone changes the world not necessarily by a noticeable amount but a non-zero amount absolutely Super valid. Guys streaming random t-shirts, not one word. Girl streaming random t-shirt, you feeling okay? Wow, slumming today. Laundry day? Yeah, 100%. I'm, I'm like, get get fucking fucked. Yeah, it was you who, who recommended uh, Skits Freedom. I've downloaded that. Um, it's on it's on the hard drive now. Uh, and I hope I... It's, it's not going to be one of those games I approach lightly, if that makes sense. I'm going to approach it, hopefully... How can I hold 300 something? I'm going to approach it with a bit more of an open mind. A very non cam partner stream where I won't name got a face cam. <laughs> Fair enough. 
I uh, I was I'm always impressed by people who don't who get their oh, oh dear there we go who uh, like get partnership and get affiliate and all this sort of stuff without a face cam. I think it, and it took me a while to sort of get the courage up to, to be on camera. It's a very good simulation to get the idea across. I try to approach everything darkly, I've got to be honest. It's my uh, resurgence of my uh, emo uh, marsh boy instinct. Oh god, these are awful. Oh, they're not. They're not full full. They're not full full, they're just full. You know the difference. You know what I mean. I bet you air hockey's full. Air hockey's full. Oh no, Cyberdance Euromix has broken down. This guy's still loving it though. Look at this guy go. Whoa. Not that bit. <laughs> Those are not dance appropriate trousers, I'm just saying. No, don't play sports. Six cents on arcade machines. And so <laughs> These are the sort of machines that will accept anything. They will accept loose change, quarters. That's because we, um, that's a good point, actually. We we have to uh, do our um, uh, capitalism uh, simulator as well. No. Oh, my God, it's the rupture. Um, uh, capitalism simulator. Here we go. Let's go on to attack vector, machine settings. So we're currently making $16 an hour from this on difficulty easy and $1.50 a game. So $16.61. If we up the difficulty, we will make nothing, basically. We get one play per hour. If we twiddle with the... No, that won't help. So hard difficulty, 1661. I don't know if that's any better. 1815. Medium difficulty, $1 play. There we go. Money, 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 money. I'm just going to click through these basically. So 644, because this is a super boring bit. 644 seems to be the best price we can get for this. That's fine. Darts. Fucking darts, man. 390 appears to be the best for this. Yep, 390 is the best for that. <laughs> How ironic that I'm changing the price um, changing the price of a game called Communists from Mars so I can squeeze as much money out of it as possible. 871 871 871 appears to be our highest. Going once, going twice, bam, gone. Cyberdance, 1740. 1740. If it makes £18 an hour, I might buy a few and not bother working. <laughs> yeah, this makes $17.10 an hour. An hour! Just get some of these. Oh, 1740 1740 appears to be our best price at the minute. 1740 Oh, no. I fucked it. 1740 There we go. Let me see even more confusing. A certain amount per hour on average is fine. <laughs> No, it's exact. <laughs> it's absolutely exact. 1266 appears to be our best number so far. I might be doing this wrong, who knows? But I mean this is this is uh gotten us lots of money so far. 1419 appears to be our best. Yeah, I think we've twiddled with a lot of these settings already. <laughs> to be honest with you. The jukebox. No one cares about the jukebox. King Fury, 1281 appears to be our best. 1281. 1281. Cool. Line Terror. God. 360. This game's dirt cheap. Because we've not played it, basically. Um, so there's a popularity bonus. Uh, you can get the different bonuses. Um, you can get the money higher if you get the different bonuses. The different bonuses are things like cleanliness bonus, location location bonus. I didn't realize that was a thing. Fame bonus, goal bonus. So you completely different goals in the game and playtime bonus so the more you play it the more people want to play it basically penguin push 681 oh no 736 736 whoever made this has never been in an arcade that thing's always going at a quarter song three minutes per song <laughs> yep <laughs> 736 736 736 going once 20 twice bam 
Roger. One dollar. Six dollars an hour just by changing the difficulty. Six seventy-five. Six seventy-five. Six seventy-five. Racer chips it. No, not the thirty-one dollars an hour. Wow, we have put in that time for this. Oh my days. But if your option is to pay our 0.5, 1, or 1.5, how the F do you pay X point Y6? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. 31, 68. Oh, my gosh. Did you get a racer chase again? 31, 68. It's our best so far. 31, 68. 31, 68. 31, 68. Still 31, 68. Okay, cool. I think I left that one on high. <laughs> uh, hang on a minute. These aren't... Oh no, these are, I think these are actual, these are actual people. These are real, real humans. Uh, 450 appears to be our top price for this. Oh no, I completely screwed that up. There we go. I think he's averaging in free time. <laughs> My immersion is ruined. I know, right? I have to actually think about the numbers. What are they? Uh, 25, 20, 28, 80. Oh my god. 28, 80 is our best bet so far. 28, 80. Ka -ching. That's because we did such an amazing run last time. That's probably a really good one to play more of. Actually, that has a, oh, a playtime bonus of nothing. The basic popularity is 23. Oh yeah, so we just, we slammed those uh, uh, goals last time. Holy shit. Uh, 612. 612. 612. Like I said, I'm going to try and do this as quick as I can. Be a couple of minutes. 2492. 2492. 2492 is our best. Strike gold. 628. 641. Me squeezing the last few cents out of all of my customers. 25, 25. Oh my god, 36, 99. Nice. 36, 99, my god. Uh, 21, 29. 24, 59. Oh, what was that? 24, 59, 24, 39. 24, 59. Video air hockey. This should be a pretty decent one. 2102. Oh no, I'm doing it wrong. Uh, I do the the price and then change the thing. 2102. 2102. 21. 2102 is the best, I think. Yeah, 2102. That's weird. Uh, Vostok. 719. Oh, 765. 765. Nearly there. We've only got a few more left. Uh, 337. 337 is the best. 375. 375. Going once. Going twice. What bam. Second to last one. 1089. 1089. 1089. 1089 and going once. Going twice. Bam. And it's finally Zombat. Zombat. Uh, sorry. Zombat 2. Uh, 617. 617. 617. Oh, yep. Yeah, 617 is our best. Done. Job done. Right, what time of day is it? It is 11.15 in the morning. Fantastic. Oh, the token machine is full. Meow. Meow. That's what that said a second ago. Meow. Right. Stick that in here. Deposit this five grand. Ka-chunk. 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 Right. That, I think, is enough to buy our next thingy. Yeah, it is. Good. Purchase that. Lovely. Oh, we got an email. What do I have an email from? Oh, is it somebody... Dear RK, I don't know. I think the other person in the high school I beat on Woodgow Jr. Don't care. Do not give her monkeys. So you can... So do, what that is, sorry. Um, Basically, you can uh, get challenges from customers basically saying, can you beat this score on this game ha 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 and you're like of course i can dickhead uh and then you do it throw a javelin over 9.5 meters fucking piece of piss 
uh, easiest £15 of my life. Defeat the AI in a game of Shuttlecock and get a score of 5,000 in Kung Fury. Right, we'll do Shuttlecocks first because that's going to be the hardest. Oh, this game is fucking massive. Look at this monster. This is a, this is a thick boy. Jesus. Right, single player. I just got to win a round or a game? Around? Around? Is that it? No? Oh, defeat the AI in a game of struggle. Oh my god. How how much does this go to? Fuck. Well, we're going to be here a while. This is a good history lesson, everyone. Boink, boink, boom. I hate this game. I secretly love this game now. How many points is in this game? Pong hates me too. Yep. <laughs> Pong's always hate me. Pong knows what I did. Fuck. Got it. Oh my god, how many points is in this? Please don't be 10. I don't want to be here for 10 points. Please be 6. I swear to God, I'm going to rage quit so hard. We are such gamers. Shuttle Cox. Hello, Darcy Sue. How are you? Please be six. Please be seven. Please be eight. Please be nine. Please be ten. <laughs> please be one, seven, three. Please be one, seven, four. Uh, right. The summer of sports. Summer sports. It was the what was it? Javelin. We're gonna get our wiggle on. Wait. Over nine meters. Fucking smashed it, mate. Absolutely smashed it. There's no stopping us. We are. We're like Robocop. Yeah, we're closing the machine. I don't care. Fucking 12 meters. That's a new world record. Fuck it. We're so good at this. What was the other one? Easiest money of my life. Uh, get a score of 5,000 in Kung Fury. Oh, that's going to suck so hard. Ugh. Let's try a different character. I need a drink. Bear with me two seconds. I have drinks just there in the fridge. Bear with me. So... So I got myself some... I decided, right, bear with me. So I've got a mini fridge, right, in this room, because uh, I'm a grown up and I can, and I want to live my best teenage boy fantasy. Um, and I, I would pack it with like fizzy drinks. And I realized that my IBS doesn't like fizzy drinks. 
So I was drinking so much fizzy drinks that my IBS was like, you're going to be horrendously unwell every day. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta do one or the other, mate. Like, be a grown up and have IBS, or be a kid and drink fizzy drinks. Like, but one's gonna lead to something else, right? Anyway, so I've uh, been trying out different flat drinks, and this one is orange and passion fruit. And I'm just wondering, because it's in a carton, I was wondering if they had a straw, but they don't. They just. You just, you just peel and, peel and suck. Just really nice. Really, really nice. Uh, imagine if they pulled a Knights of the Old Republic-like swoop racing trick where you did your best and then someone always beats your time by some amount and then you have to beat the best. I think that's what, genuinely, I think that's what happens with the high scores in this. I'm going to play as Barbarana. Barbarana, why not? Maybe it's to make customers say this song. So I just need a f score of 5,000. That's all I need. Did she have a minigun? Yes. Yes, she did. So she's a barbarian with a minigun. I don't understand this character development. Like, get, make me understand why, firstly, why is she wearing the skull of an animal on her head? Presumably the skull of an animal. And secondly, like, why has she got a minigun? 2,500, that sucked. These characters are awful. Right, try again. Hackerman's terrible. Triceracop. Animal score is badass. A barbarian is more about their personality, not their weaponry. <laughs> Absolutely. I need to know. Make me, make me, you know. My God, this person's got a lot of, uh, what is, I'm sorry. Are you an assassin? Pew, pew, pew. Pew, pew, pew. I take it back. This character might be the best. And loads of health too. I'm, I'm appreciating the five hearts. Triceracop. This just reminds me of um, Space Precinct. That's a. That's a. Oh. Oh my God. Such. <laughs> the character is always horny. <laughs> I'm not playing as a bard. All right. Let's try somebody else. Yeah. No. Triceracop has the best thingy, but Kung Fury probably has the best attack. To be honest with you, I can't move like normally. <laughs> you spoony bard. I gotta make sure I get my bonus up as well. There we go. Times 20. Oh, Lord. There, we got 5,000. Leave. We got 5,000. Don't, don't give me this. Get a score of 5,000. We, we, but we did it. In Kung Fury or as Kung Fury? No, we got it. We got it. You fucking, oh, this game. This actual game. I swear to God. Right, come on. Whoppa, whoppa, whoppa. Don't forget, it's like a rhythm action game. Pa, 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 pa. I can't actually move. I just move when I hit. Oh, I, I get how to kill them now. Oh, I didn't do it very well, did I? There we go. It, it didn't register because I didn't finish the level. Got it. Easiest to do of my life. Mm. I did not know that's what Spoonie Bard meant. Sentimentally or foolishly amorous. <laughs> that's fair enough. That's, that'll do it. That's that's pretty accurate. So how much money money have we got? 
Money, 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 money. Ninety pounds. What um upgrades can we buy for ninety pounds? I don't think anything actually. What's the flashy light up there? Hud stuff. <laughs> nothing. Nothing for ninety pounds. That's what Spoonie means, not necessarily Spoonie Bot. I understand. Right, what are we what are we doing? What are we doing? What should we play? What should we play? Someone pick a game. Pick a game. Pick a game. While well, I play smoke them again. With my mouse like a fucking cheat. How did the translator know that word even? Uh disable flash. Thank you. Oh no. That's me disabling the flash. That's me enabling it. Curses. Dragon. Disable. Okay. Guess who spent way too long as a kid in uh, arcades playing shooting games? Oh, I missed one. Oh, I didn't. Good. Oh, I shot a skull. I just, I just wanted to be metal. That could have been Skull for all I know. Right, so the more we play this, the more popular it will get. So hopefully the more money it will earn. I nearly died then. I know we've only got eight seconds left. You haven't given me any time bonuses. There, there. Now I have slightly more time bonuses. Go. Right, oh, well, that was a good. Oh, 220. That was a pretty decent. That was a pretty decent round. Um, right. What gals adventure? We haven't played this for a while. Duck hunt. They, they make duck hunt for the Wii. Oh, you missed the dunk. D dunk. You missed the dunk. You missed the dunk. Uh, you missed the duck plate shooting game from Nintendo Wii Sports game. That was a version of duck hunt, wasn't it? I think. Right. Come on. Let's go. Get the fuck out the way, you slimy bastards. Uh, go. Go, go. What is... <sighs> Get off my bridge. Look, I'm a woman not to be trifled with. All right. There's the penguins from Penguin Push. Uh, X. How do... I've got four gold stars. I mean, seven. Come here, bat. Real... Where a gatekeep duck hunter would know. <laughs> You're right, though. It was a it was originally played with the CRT TV and the Zapper. I used to have um, Duck Hunt. <laughs> I've, I've told this story a million times. Uh, I used to have uh, Duck Hunt, and we used to have um, when we got the SNES, right? We uh, had the Super Blaster, I think. It was called or the the super zapper. I can't remember what it was called. Basically, it was it was basically a shoulder mounted bazooka that you you shot at the screen. Um, and it there's a game on that. I have to Google at some point. There's a game on that that makes the most horrific noise that used to give me nightmares. Um, the snes zapper. Yeah, the the whole the the bazooka. Yeah, bit it was massive. A scope, super scope. I think it was called. Um, yeah, it was huge. 
It was, it was a legit bazooka, it was massive. And yeah, one of the games made it an awful noise, an absolutely awful noise. And it used to give me nightmares for so long. But that was around the time my uh, my dad, in his infinite wisdom, uh, turned around and said, oh, we're gonna get rid of the SNES because Nintendo don't know what they're doing. So we're gonna sell the SNES and we're gonna buy a um, Mega Drive instead. Which is why I was then a Mega Drive boy for the rest of my childhood. Uh, which I'm very pleased for, because Mega Drive had some absolutely stonking games. But SNES also had some excellent games. And, you know, Nintendo don't know what they're doing. This is the exact words. <laughs> He's dead now. Uh, unrelated. But I am... Um, oh, I'm, I'm dying. Oh no. There, do that. And then do that. You're going to be very careful with enunciation. Very careful. Not going to lie, the name Duck Hunt sounds kind of rude adjacent. <laughs> oh dear. It's like a, what is it, a spoonerism. Like, um, cunning stunt. What a cunning stunt you are. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. 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 I'm dead. I'm gonna die. I'm dead. Ah, you fucker. I thought he was always dead. Yep, he's dead. He's he's dead now. <laughs> he shuffled off this mortal coil. Uh, he was whacked by Nintendo. <laughs> For crimes against PR. Oh, all my oppers are full, aren't they? Come on. Something else was full. I don't know what it was. I'm going to guess it was Racer Chaser. <laughs> yup. It was Racer Chaser. Uh, nope. No, it's not actually not full. What time it is it? It is... Oh, it's oh pixelated lady. I really kind of... I really kind of want to complete this. I don't know why. Oh, God, no. I'm out. I'm not getting... I'm not getting munched by a red slime. I'm not getting munched by a peasant slime like you. The only games I liked in the Genesis was, well, one game was Toe Jam and Earl. Toe Jam and Earl, I was too young to appreciate when it came out. Oh, fuck off. Right, we'll go, we'll go genius taking a rest. Uh, let's try Zombat. I was too young for Toe Jam and Earl. When did Toe Jam and Earl come out? I'll tell you how old I was. Um, because I'll have played it when it came out because we didn't buy games back then. We rented them and they were only in the rental shop for about six months and then they, they disappeared and you could then you could only buy them. Um but I didn't realise what I didn't know what to do. I didn't know what to do in Toe Jumper. It was only when I played the remake recently that I'm like, oh this this is how I was six, right? If it came out in I one, I was six. I was definitely too young to understand shoot to understand um Toe Jumper now. But uh, yeah, I just didn't understand what was what was going on with it, and I had to play it. It was colourful and it made funny noises, and I liked it. But yeah, other than that, I was just like, I don't, I don't know what's going on, right? So yeah, ninety-five, and then when I was six, so I've been six or seven, give or take. I'm not sure how long it took them to go from uh, normal like retail shops to things like blockbusters and stuff like that. Um, but. Yeah, it was only when I played the remake on Switch recently, uh, I was like, oh, I remember Touch of Note being really, really good and colourful and uh, it was cheap as well on Switch. So I'm like, oh, I'll get one. And then I started playing it. And I'm like, oh, this is how you play it. I'm like, I wonder if this is how you play the original. So I went back and played the original. And yeah, it turns out it is exactly how you play the original. Die, zombies. Oh, I got mushed by a big boy zombie. Right, get that off. I'm not very good at that game. And I don't like it. Oh, this is broken. Curses. Wabam. Wabam. Oh. I'm just <laughs> flicking circuit boards. It's what I like to do in my spare time. I like to flick circuitry. What of it? Um, Blobbus has often got the game before the stores in some cases. Ooh, wow. Like here, we got everything after everyone else in the US had it. Oh, that's also broken. No. Everything's falling apart. Get off. Get off. Get off. 
Ooh, I see. I don't know if we ever had an instance where Blobbuster got a game. Oh, fuck, that's broken too. This is because I was spending so long playing the game. Um, I don't know if we had an instance of a game being out in Blobbuster before the stores. I do remember a good number of times when we rented a game so much that basically... So we had two places we went to, Blobbusters um, and a little third-party owned game shop. And the third party on game shop basically uh imagine you could walk in walk three steps to the counter one step sideways and three steps back and that was the whole space you had but all the walls were lined with games right um and we got we rented a couple of mega drive games at one point for so so many times because i enjoyed them so much uh oh hoppers for you first um, that basically the owner was like, if you give us a tenner, you can have it. <laughs> and you gotta remember, like, games games back then were like £3.50 a night, and I'd have them for like a week or something like that. Because that was, that was a good way for my parents to, one, keep quiet, and two, like, show love, right? Like, time was, times were tough, and when he was, when he was scarce, so if they could play £3.50 for a night's worth of entertainment for the for their son, that's fantastic. Because he was obsessed with video games. And still is. Uh, curiously, I only played it the first time sometime between 2005 and 2009 with a university colleague doing online sign-up for the new semester. As you'd imagine, an entire university doing sign-up at the same time. Whew, for all the degrees, all years at the same time, kind of a heavy, heavy load on an unprepared system. So it was really slow, so we played online games while waiting. <laughs> That's fair enough. Do what you need to. I remember quite clearly, so I didn't go to university, I went to um, thingy. Uh, I went to college and we played uh, Quake, Quake 1 because someone had networked. So all the machines were networked, but someone had set up Quake 1 on one specific class. So it would be a only on like six or seven machines in the back. Um, so it was always a race to get to the front of that uh, queue. So you could get, you knew the first six people were always there just to play Quake <laughs> and not do work. Right, let's try and play Line Terror because I like Line Terror, but it obviously doesn't like me. I was reading some article about how Sears died and Amazon killed them, and it's amazing. I love shit like that sometimes. I love watching documentaries about stuff like that. We didn't get Walmart for years. We had Amos and Kings, but we did have Sears. Ooh. We only played non full screen games, we usually emulated stuff like GBA, SNES, and such, which we could play windowed without any loss of visuals. Emulating wasn't really a thing back in my college days, I don't think. Yeah, I don't think it was really. I didn't really know about emulating until later on. But then, like I said, I'm fucking mega wrong. Um. Oh, the things have bugged. The the baddies have bugged in the corner. Good, good. That's a good bug, that is. That's not a bad bug. That's a good bug. Can you piss off, Stickman? Go away. Should be. I got them on PCs in school. <laughs> that's, that's fair enough. <laughs> I'm so old. I can tell you the story about the first game I tried to emulate, and it went horrifically wrong. Uh, I tried to emulate. Goal complete, yay! Uh, I tried to emulate um, uh, Castlevania 64 on a Pentium 1 with 1 gigabyte storage with my first PC. It's a hand-me-down from my uncle. So it wasn't a gaming PC by any stretch of any imagination. It was... Uh, it had Windows 95 and Dungeon Keeper on it, was it? It was physically all that could fit on it. Uh, but I did I did learn a lot by playing Dungeon Keeper. You know? I mean, that's how I manage my business now. 
Go away, please. Stickman. Stickman. Thank you. Uh, oh, no, I'm stuck. There we go. But uh, that's where I learned to edit uh, any files. Which could have maybe sent me on this path of this bloody career. Oh, I got munched by a sprite. No, no I don't want to get killed. I don't want to die. Wait, hang on. Lion Terror. Get past level 1. Fill 40% with a single line. Complete level at least 85% filled in. Alright, well we can try. This feels like it's... Oh no! Oh, fuck it. <laughs> oh, I fucked it. But well, that's all going to be possible on the first level then, isn't it? Something's full and I don't know what it was. First one emulator, also in university from a different colleague playing Aria of Shadow. I got so hooked on AOS, Symphony of the Night and such. My first time playing Castlevania games. That's fair enough. Ever wonder why Amazon has wish lists specifically? Apparently Bezos worked at Sears catalogue department. He said in the early net days, win 311 days, uh, he went to the CEO of Sears with a presentation about putting the Sears catalogue online. The CEO said, Computers? Who the hell wants to shop on a computer? Kids want their wish book. And fired them uh, for wasting company time. 20 years later, Sears went to Amazon offering a merger. Bezos threw them out for wasting his time. I mean, I kind of I kinda like that. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. That's the sort of petty, spiteful shit I would do. Just be like, no, <laughs> just go fuck yourself. Uh, right, line terror, forty percent with a single line. We can do that, probably. Uh, right there, that'll do. Uh, we're dead. We're dead. We fucked it. I know. That's not forty percent. That's not even close. That's thirty-five though. That was close. Line terror. Line terror. So we need to be over here. And then we need to go like that. Yeah. Stay there, stay there, stay there. No, 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 no. Yes. He's lost his goddamn mind. Oh, he's dead. He's dead. He's dead. He's not dead. He's not dead. He's not dead. Oh, my God. He's absolutely easy. Also, poil. But Polaroid? Polaroid? Polaroid invented the digital camera. They said, this is crap. People want real photos. <laughs> and they open sourced the patent. They chucked it out. 20 years later, they fi they filed for chapter 11 and got it sold off. And got sold off. I see. God, you are just a, a vast wealth of information. I love stuff like that, though. I love finding out lots to follow because that that information there that that's in my head now and that's good pub information that is. It was very uncommon, but the internet had tripled in size in two years. I believe it. I believe it. Uh, oh, it's it's half past midnight. The business is closing. We need to count up. <laughs> how much more? I know. So that em uh, that empties hopper. Empties hopper. I've forgotten how words work. That hopper's empty. What I am. Uh, we got this. We got uh, this. We got this. Uh, oh, we're not doing great. What's a really bad one? Really bad ones. Let's have a look what really bad ones are. And then we can play those games a bit more. Oh, God. We need to keep emptying these hoppers. <laughs> uh, empathy. Empathy's only earned us $50 the entire day. So that's garbage. Empty these more often. Darts as well. You can tell which games I don't play. Which is weird because how much I have played Empathy. I've played loads of it. Uh, Line Terror? We were just playing that. Although we were playing it after hours, so that's fair enough. So like, where is the hopper? There it is. Uh, yeah, Roger. Okay, fair enough. Roger, Roger. Uh, that one too. Yep, yeah, cool. Hopper's full on air hockey. Hopper's probably been full on air hockey for a while. Let's be honest. Oh, UFO assault low. Boom. Right, cool. So we got $3,900. Cool. Come on. There we go. Oh, we nearly got it again. There we go. 
$3,900. I don't think there's anything else we can buy right now. I think we just got to get out of here. Was that human? No, it wasn't. It was Kung Fury. To the bus stop, quickly. Go. Mm -hmm. Orange and passion fruit. Nothing like flavoured liquid from a carton. Yeah. Someone's just delivered a coffin. <laughs> All right, that can only go there. And now we're going to get a chat message. Yep. Da, 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 da. I, I could care less about most of this stuff now. Yum. Chat message. Hey, Ash, what's good? Business. Business is good. <laughs> I think Dad's almost proud of me. Not that he said that, it was more of a tone thing and the lack of swearing. <laughs> You're coming into your own. It's great to see. And it's fun helping out. Shame we couldn't hang out more before. Yeah, even more before you left for college. Even before you left for college, you were all studying recitals. That's it. That's the words. Come on, brain. You've only been streaming for a few hours. Recitals. I barely knew I had a sister. Wow, fucking harsh, man. Yeah... Hey, what would you say to coordinating off, uh, cordoning off a portion of the laundry? Bring the arcade forwards. Totally. I'll say we're upgrading and replacing old machines with new. Dad will love it, and it's technically true. Say the word. How much do we need? Five grand. Do it. Purchased. It's <laughs> so what we need to do. And then we'll... Turn off our upgrade for time control. There we go. Ooh. Oh, yeah. That's fine. Uh, turn off our upgrade for time control so that time moves at a normal pace instead of slightly slower. And then by the time we've finished... Oh, God, I'm stuck. By the time we've finished this, then we will be able to finish the day, see the new layout. Oh, gum. Oh, does this not does this not go in the bin? I thought that counted towards trash. Okay. Xerox invented the mouse for copiers before pieces. Wait, what? <laughs> Is it rude now with the fucking law bombs right now for technology? Uh, yeah, but so either way, they kept a very outdated operating system or internet which was really crap in 3.11 days. Imagine if Amazon deliveries and such came that spe <laughs> that spectacular. Uh, Mongum. Xerox invented the mouse for copiers before PCs did. Jobs worked for Xerox and told the CEO, this is great, we could use this for a computer. Interface. Oh, I have heard this. The CEO said, sure, whatever. Jobs bought the patent for something like a grand. He had them take out, out of his paycheck. And uh, he gave it to Woz to build for Apple II around... Apple II around. Uh, MS copied it free. The court battle costs cost both millions. Tens of millions, the statement. The settlement was office stays on Mac, Windows get to use the mouse patent. I love that. I love stuff like that. Oh, do you think I'd have more of those on hand in my brain from like video games? Uh, you go in the bin, yes, but you need a bigger bin that can fit you. you. Fit me, you need a fucking massive bin. I'm huge. I'm ginormous. Uh... There we go. Some of that, some of that. No gum on there. No, okay. Any gum on there? No, okay. Any gum on here? Gum, gum. Gizzy gum. Gizzy gum, mate. Gizzy gum. Oh, the bag's full. Curses. I just read random crap like that a lot of the time because it's I'm too easily bored. That's a sign of a very intelligent human being. Right there. Easily bored. Amazing. Imagine if Microsoft pulled Office out of Mac. Would Windows have to stop supporting mice? <laughs> it's such a... I, lo I love these uh, like old like rival uh, tech firm in the like 80s and 90s deals that went down. Ooh, I, I completely forgot we bought a table, a snooker table. 
Am I actually have to play that in a second? God, I've not played snooker in a, a long, long time. Snooker slash pool. Pool is my preference because I have to think less. <laughs> not even joking. Well, where's the other bit of gum? I've only had two. Is it on here? No. I have clean clothes. I know I've got clean clothes. I don't give a shit. Oh, it's there. There it is. Uh, is anything full? No, cool, we're good. Right, let's go and play this. Easy, no, easy. <laughs> Normalize easy. Oh, this is just like uh, the simulator I used to play. The pool simulator. Lift and drop the ball. Whee! Then move this. Then go whack. And watch the frame rate tank. Oh, it is actually pool. Cool. Cool pool. Uh, change ball spin. Nice. So I put... I do that. And put a back spin on it. It'll come back. I'll do... Okay, sweet. And whack. Oh, that didn't work. I hit one, though, so it's not a foul. Oh, I didn't hit mine. Curses. I hit theirs. That is a foul. I didn't realize I potted one. Okay, so I'm spots. Got it. Nah. Dickhead. <laughs> Incorrect ball potted. Ball in hand. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Lift. Lift ball. No? All right, fine. Uh, right, so you've not left me a lot of options, friend. I've got to admit. Can I? Oh no! Can I see the table? No. Nope. Can't see the table. Going to assume that's a spot over there. That's a green spot. And we're going to go whack and hope that that potted. Who knows? Might have potted. Might not have potted. Uh, ooh. Well, I mean, we can try. Nope, didn't work. But I hit a spot, not a stripe. So I think it's not a foul. It's there go, but it's not a foul. Oh, I've set one nicely for that, haven't I? Shame they fucked it up. Uh, I'll ignore those. And I will go for you. Bang. Oh, I put the white. No. Put two of mine, though, so that's cool. That's fine. You, you can go. I'm not going to be able to do a lot with this. Did you? I mean, if I go here, I might be able to get it. Who knows? Nah. But I can get it away from the edge, so that's a good thing. And it's not a foul. Wow, I forgot how much I enjoy these games. Holy crap. This is where they just clear the board. Or not. I love how these um, angle markers are completely wrong. Right, so regardless of where I hit that, it's, it's going to... Right, cool. Let's just... I'll tell you what. Do that. Oh, that was, that was close. That was close. Oh, oh, are you going to put the white? Not quite. Not quite. Turn, 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 turn. Let's go that one in there. Oh, I missed you, pillock. Absolute pillock. Come on, I've only got three balls left to pop. I think they're all relatively easy to get as well. <laughs> like that one, for example. Of oh, course, I'm playing as a professional computer. A professional computer, as opposed to an amateur computer. Oh, I need to Disastrous. 
You have wet clothes waiting in the machine. Don't care. Yes, pop one of mine. I'm not doing it. So if I miss this, I'm going to scream. Scream, I tell you. Boink. Had I thought about that, that could have been a really good trick shot. Err. Well, err. I mean, that might work. It's not gonna, but it might. Funky music. Wait, hang on. What was the what the things on this? Hustler. That's I don't think they've named that correctly. That's that's not what they should have named that. Um, goals. Pot two balls with one shot. Win a game against the AI. Win three games against the AI. Cool. So we'll get one at least. I hope anyway. We only got two balls left to go. Let's go for you. Let's go like this. And watch the frame rate tank for some unknown bloody reason. We had an emergency sticker and a fire department handed it out. And the sticker to the phone. Imagine being in a fire, traps, and having to dial 8664716 on the on a rotary phone. Oh my god. <laughs> I cannot imagine that at all. Uh, having having been someone who has had to call 999, uh, which is the UK equivalent of 911, and also being someone who has worked for 999 operators, uh, yeah, <laughs> I cannot imagine that being a, a thing that would, I've experienced. Oh, don't go in the hole. Please don't go in the hole. I've experienced both sides of it, and it being a very easy to remember number is a godsend. <laughs> Come on. Where's the other one? Oh, it's behind me. Of course it is. Well, I can't get that, can I? Let's be honest. Let's just whack. It might go in, might not. Who knows? Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Why is it always the last few? Why are you surrounding me? I don't surround me with your balls. Hi, questionable results. That's an excellent time to uh, come in, isn't it? Doink. Always the last moment. Incorrect ball hit. Eh? Huh? I hit, I hit mine. Didn't I? Did I not? Was I not paying attention? I might not have been paying attention. Good timing. Mike is surrounded by strangers' balls. Fantastic. You fucker. <laughs> Go fuck yourself, player two. Ha! See? Dickhead. Ball in hand. That means I can move it around. Because you wait, it does. It should mean I can move it around because you potted it. So I should be able to move this. But I can't because you won't let me. Because it's probably a fucking bug. Uh, right. Let's put some spin on this. Let's put some front spin on it. And let's go whack. And that didn't work. Fantastic. I hit it too hard. I hit the ball with the stick too hard. That's what I've done. I can't believe I've done this. <laughs> I have given this away. Where are you shooting? You you are all over the shop, mate. You could have at least hit those balls then. The cue didn't hit. Oh, that means I can move it. I can move it here. Uh, right, let's go there. That was a, that was a bad placement. That was bad, bad, bad placement. But. Fucking get in the hole! I swear to God, these spots are bigger than the holes. If you hit that, if you pot the black, you're fucked, mate. You done fucked it. I win, you lose. 
Well, Hustler. <laughs> it's an awful name for a game. <laughs> well, we won some of it, so that's cool. Uh, right, what time is it? It's nine o'clock. So we're going to like an, uh, a couple of in game hours, so a couple of minutes. And then we're going to empty everything. Is this hopper full? No, not quite. We're going to empty everything. And then it's the next day. And then we get to see our new digs. <laughs> Mom's favorite story is when I ask them to call me back in five minutes. Yes, that's a thing they do often. They'd often ring back. The phone rang. I picked it up. Mom was confused why someone was calling me. And I told the operator, thank you. I just wanted to feel important. <laughs> You showed the in-game watch at 20.57 and real time in the UK and Portugal, 20.58. Well, now it's half past nine, so... I've completely ruined that, haven't I? Completely ruined the immersion of that. Uh, right. Is there anything... Oh, yeah, I forgot I can zoom. Is there anything full? 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 No? Full? Don't mind me paying patrons. I'm just going to crawl along the floor. I'm, oh, fuck. And this... I'm trying not to contract fucking herpes off this carpet. Uh, oh god, well, that's not going to be full. No, oh, that's not full. No, oh, that's not full either. We're not doing very good, are we? Oh, no. Is this because the the arcade's not clean? What she saying is, no, it is. It's not fully clean because I, some of the trash is bugged. Thanks, game. Thanks, nosebleed. Ooh. Oh, I see. Because the time is running quicker, 200. That means that the uh, hoppers aren't filling up as much. Got it. Now I understand. Right, I'm bored of waiting. Bored of waiting. I've got the attention span of a gnat. Oh, trash. What the? Herpes would be the best news for you that you could get crawling on an arcade carpet. Like, I'm fairly sure if they were around now, COVID-47 would be incubating an arcade carpet someplace. There's a place in my old, old hometown now that actually has uh, an arcade. Uh, I mean, obviously, the, the seafront. I'm from Blackpool, so the seafront has lots of arcades anyway. But there's a... There's a I wonder what the fuck that was then. It's cues. Um, they have lots of arcades on the seafront anyway, but... They uh, have a, a single pay arcade. So you basically go in the door, um, you pay like £15 or something like that for the day, and then all the machines are open and free. And it's, it's so many things from so many different eras. Like I think I played uh, Time Crisis, Point Blank, I played Mich uh, Missile Command, fuck off. Um, I played um, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Simpsons arcade game, loads of stuff, loads and loads and loads of stuff. Uh, loads of Afterburner, uh, Space Harrier, loads of stuff I haven't played in years. And some stuff I'd never played because obviously they were expensive. Um, but yeah, whoa, proper, proper kid vibes running around an arcade and it all being free. But yeah, they had a pretty, even they had a pretty gnarly carpet. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> MD Hopper, MD Hopper, MD Hopper, oh my god. This is my life, just crawling around, crawling around a dirty carpet. Search, scrounging for money. Get off, okay, just get off. The whole wingy carpet because you have echoes. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I'd have used rubber exercise mats 100%. I don't, I don't think that's why this carpet's like this. I think this is so when people drop money, they don't see it. That's honestly how, what I think. Wow, we did shit today. Takings were down, people, I'm so sorry. I just got assaulted by an arcade. I just got mugged. <laughs> got fucking mugged. Right, cool. Put that in there. Run. Oh, wait. What? Ah, I'm stuck on a door. What upgrades can we afford? What can we afford? What have we got? Still 90. Wait, what? What was today's to-dos? Oh, we didn't do any of the to-dos. Wow, we fucked that, haven't we? Mm, piss. Yum. Let's go see our new digs. Arcade Paradise. 
That's not so, that's not it. New washing machines? Excellent. Excellent. When you were younger and I was building my great corporate empire, oh, mate, shut the fuck we up. saw little of each other. Did I make mistakes? Of course, I'm not infallible. Perhaps I could have been more attentive. <laughs> but I never stumbled in business. And that's what matters. So if you need advice, and no doubt you will, <gasps> you'll find I'm quite approachable. My door is always open. <clears throat> Fix the toilet. Arcade open. We have an arcade sign outside now. Look. <laughs> we have an actual... We have an actual arcade oh, It's a slidey door as well. Fix the toilet. There is no toilet anymore. Oh, so there's less space. Excellent. Less space to do laundry. I'm fine with this. I'm perfectly fine. What's the locker? Oh, there is. It's just a locker with some funky stickers on. Uh, oh, look at all this. Oh, yeah. So we've literally chopped. So this is where the thing was. This is where the door was. So we've chopped this entire bit off. So this toilet now is an arcade toilet. I mean, it's still a toilet, but you know. <laughs> My head cannon is that your character is devolving into Gollum, pasty white, <laughs> pasty white from never seeing daylight, giant eyes that can see in the darkness, always red and watery from flashing lights, scrambling around coin box to coin box, muttering, "What's it got in its pockets? Is my precious." <laughs> Oh, excellent. Assistant manager's office. Oh, look at this. Look at our new... Oh, this trash. I left, I left trash in here. Oh, we've got, we've got a lava lamp and everything. Oh. Oh. We've gone, we've gone up in the world. Yeah, I think this game was made by someone from the 90s pretending they remembered the 80s. Yeah. So, Arcade Mania. So, what else have we got now? Oh, we've got... Bugai, Thumper Gopher, Fruit Crush, uh, <laughs> fuck's sake, stream elements, sorry, would know. I think it was Rudno that got timed out last time. I really let me make a note. I like, will tell you what, let me make a note. Now we've now we've sort of come to the end of our little journey. Let me make a note using my new notepad. And sorry, this is my old one because I'm going to use my new magnets. It never ends when in time. It's just, it will always get time. I need to fucking change it. I need to change that because no one no one abuses it. Everyone's quite chill to this video. I'm gonna. I'll change the view so you can at least see the arcade. There we go. <laughs> can you see the lovely, uh, lovely um, thingy, uh, Venetian blind? Oh my god! I cannot open a sharpie. Days. There we go. Achievement unlocked. I've opened a sharpie. Fix. Chat box. Caps. There. I made a note. Right. <laughs> I'll start abusing it. Me like I don't care. I don't care. That really pisses me off. Sorry, casually. I'm for over. That's fair enough for now. We're we're wrapping up now, and hopefully, I've written a note, and hopefully, it'll be fixed by next time. My apologies for that. I'm going to stick that to my thing with one of my sexy new magnet pins. But we are going to wrap up here because uh, it's past my go time. Um, so where am I next? I've got my physical IRL streaming schedule here. Uh, where am I next? Where am I next? What day is it? It's the first. I'm on again tomorrow. Tomorrow, uh, three hours, six to nine. And then I'm on on Friday. Also three hours, six to nine. That'd be cool. So yeah. We're going to be playing this again. Uh, we're going to be playing this still. I think we're in the closing stages of it, to be honest with you. Um, it kind of feels like it's in the closing stages, but uh, you will care. You will care. <laughs> we'll see, Katniss. We'll see. 
Uh, thank you, Crash for results for all that. Uh, don't forget, one of these streams this week is going to have a giveaway uh, on, so you'll be able to check out. Obviously, it's not this one, but on one of them, if you're tuning in, you'll be able to win a copy of this on GOG. Because uh, what I'll do is I'll just go and buy a copy on GOG and gift it to someone. Um, but yeah, that's going to be it. We're, I'm not going to save it. I'm just going to quit out when I quit this. Uh, so we'll load back in to this new day because we've been flying around for a while and it's like half past 12. I'm kidding. I can't be even unless I have to. But, that's um, but yeah, otherwise, thank you very much for tuning in. I uh, will see you all tomorrow. Have an absolutely wonderful evening. And yeah, stay safe, stay wonderful. And I'll see you in a bit. Take it easy, everyone. Bye bye. He says, not having his keyboard on, because he was farting around with his keyboard earlier, and also not having uh, OBS open, because it makes his game crash. Catch you in a bit, everyone. Bye-bye.